we'll see. So welcome to another Solar Auxilia game on the Barefoot Miniatures channel. I'm joined today by... Rich. And we've actually both got Solar Auxilia today. We have, yeah. Yeah. So First game for me. What have you gone with? Because we just get straight into it, right? Because everyone has seen my Solar Auxilia before. Yeah. But what, have you, what are you leaning towards with Solar Auxilia? What are your thoughts since they've come out? Well, mine's very different now. Because in, in, I've had my army about six or seven years. And in first edition, I wouldn't have left the house without a lightning, without all my medics, without mm. my... Um, I forgot the name of it already, the super heavy... Uh, yeah, the Storm Hammer. The Storm, 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 Storm Sword, which was just about the best unit in the game. Um, and I've got a lot of Jacosans as well. So oh, that's the one that ignored cover It was the, the massive It, it was a Typhon on steroids, yeah. more hull points, bigger template. Best thing, I miss it, miss it dearly. Um, <laughs> but yes, yeah, so it's very different now. So this is my first game, and I've not really paid attention to the rules too much, so I'm, I might, <laughs> so I might forgive be, you. So I everyone forgive him in the comments, but you can uh, shout at me, I suppose. But yeah, <laughs> so I've gone with uh, a command squad, but I've gone with a marshal, or yeah. with pretty much all the kit, a paragon blade and a three-up save, an invon. And he gives um, you access to the doctrine, doesn't he? Yeah, so I've taken the solar cohort doctrine, which means um, one of my tercios is going to be a Velitaris one, because it makes them score. There's troops in line, yes. Yeah. yeah, so I've got a command squad with a Vox, uh, the big banner that makes lots of things but gives leadership and <laughs> the cohort banner yeah it the makes, cohort, it, it, makes it makes yeah. the command score scoring as well and they so they've got the vox and augury scanner um, the command relay vox that spreads the leadership yeah the command vox yeah yeah so i've then got three infantry tercios so i've got one tercio two 15 man rifle squads um both have got uh, a vox and an augury scanner nothing else I've got a Tercio, just one 10 man Laz rifle squad, yeah. just to hang around with the command squad and use their leadership. And How come you didn't include them in the 15 man Tercio squad? Um, mainly because I wasn't sure if the Velitaris counted as compulsory troops, so even though the line and troops. Oh, so you just made sure? It's, it's a bit weird, and I, Chris, our friend I talked to, is because a lot of the things where it changes something to be troops, it will say, sometimes it will say compulsory troops, sometimes it will say non compulsory, sometimes it says troops. So and what does the troops? Do? Yeah, so just it's partly partly just in case I needed uh, another compulsory one, um, mm. but also because I wanted a cheap squad just to hang around, obviously scoring, yeah. hang around with the command section. And then it didn't need to benefit from the tertio rules, yeah, because it's somewhere else. Yeah, and it doesn't need a box because it's literally going to be right next to the big banner that makes everyone brave. Yeah. Um, and then my third infantry ter tercio is two Velitaris squads, all with Volkites, with the, uh, with Voxers, and they've both got Dracosans with demolished cannons. Which is the massive upset of yeah. the new book, right? So That's yeah, Dracosans have gone down a lot because they, it's obviously a small blast, very strong. But well, it's also like 240, so around there, like 200 and something points. Yeah, I think they used to be 170, and then the demolisher was a bit on top, so mm. I think they used to be around 200 points, and they've gone up and gone down so and they're, they're only 10 transport capacity with demolish cannons you can't yeah. put a character with well, them it's sort of like paying for it twice you pay the points for the demolish cannon but you also get this reduction in transport capacity yeah. so it's, it's, it's like a both give oh, it's, you're taking it with both hands basically well that's it so it was and that's why they've not got flare shields either because again they used to have a flare shield for best part of 200 points all in so um, so yeah we'll see how they go but they're, they're scoring they're, they're <laughs> but don't decent. be expecting loads <laughs> <laughs> I've got um I've got one elite choice and it's six of the Ogrins, the nasty ones that I only got. I haven't used this army since February yeah. when I went to an event um, and I used them once and people just ran away from them or shot them. Yeah. So, so who knows? They're, they're, I mean, they're, they're great models and they're, they're tough. Well, they, they, I think they're some of the best models in the entire range. Yeah. Like mine's a 3D printed army and I will be getting those Ogrins yeah. because they just look incredible. Yeah, they are very good. So, so yeah, I've got those, and then I'm allowed, with the solar cohort, you're allowed um, one artillery tercio and one uh, armoured tercio. So I've got an artillery tercio with two lots of two rapier batteries, which are yeah. quad mortars with shatter shells, because there doesn't, there's not a lot of anti-tanking in the range at the minute, because the lightning is now about a thousand points, yeah. and we'll just get intercepted. But I think the Thunderbolt is, is a good choice, but... Have you got Thunderbolts right now? No, that's it. <laughs> so, 
So yeah, so the quads um, are good. My Armored Tur Series 2 Russes, and they're the Volkite ones with Dozer Blades and a Laz Cannon. Mm. So they should be quite good. I think they're, I think they're eight shots now, the, the Volkite. Good, yeah. Yeah, 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 so they'll be good. Um, and my last choice is a heavy sport choice, which is the Valdor Tank Hunter, which was my favorite model for years until they did the stupid rules with the Malcolm Was Wars. it? Uh, yeah, it was also you used to put a tank commander in it. Um, uh, and give you um, oh, you would snap shooting or yeah, yeah, so making other people snap you could re-roll your ordnance roll so it was strength 10 AP1 and you could re-roll your armour pen so it was beautiful before I started putting my tank commander in the um, the super heavy which yeah. was also so so yeah got that as well um, which is that has a flare shield as well because um, that used to be just 300 points base so when they stopped it being a super heavy it was a huge points for not quite so good Venator yeah um so yeah, so there's quite a lot of tanks, quite a lot of Ogrins, because it's two, two and a half thousand points as well. Yeah. Um, but still got, I don't know, 17, maybe even 80 infantry, so we'll see yeah. how we go. So facing off against that, I've got my Thorakite Auxilia, which might, like, they're allied to the Iron Warriors in the books, yes. lead from the hills in Olympia. So on that, I'm also running a Solar contingent. Yep. Or like cohort. Solar type cohort, that's the one. So I've got Velotaris as scoring troops as well yeah. or line troops I've got a Legate Marshal, Marshal which has got an Inferno Pistol Thunder Hammer Artificer Armor Iron Halo Cyber Familiar all the fun stuff I've got a Tactical Command Tertio which has got 10 Command Companions with 5 power weapons and blast pistols blast pistols are actually like strength 6 2 shots each now so actually really good they used to be like strength 4 AP dash being strength six, two shots. Mm. Really nice. So they've got them power weapons. Got two grenade launchers, a command box cohort Vexilla. That's another moan. They lost the haywire grenades. They did. Yeah, they, they were, did. They That's were why I've got the grenade launchers. Mm. So then I've got two units of 10 companions, which are peer teams, which yep. were going to be my grenade launcher haywire things, but they now melt guns, short range okay. peers. Yep. They're both in Aurochs transports for those companions. I've then got, and those Aurochs have pintle multi-lasers. Okay. I've got an infantry tertio with three identical rifle squads. They're all 10 man, all got a Vox interlink, and all got an auxilia vexilla. Okay. Right, I've got that exactly the same thing again. So that's 60 total LAS rifles with Voxes and all that sort of stuff. I've then got Velotaris tertio, so that's two Volkite Velotaris yep. with a box interlink in each squad. Okay. And a heavy flamer Velotaris squad. Because they were flamers last edition, right? Yeah. Heavy flamers now, so, yeah. so much better. They're, all three of them squads are all in Aurochs with Pintle multi lasers. I've then got three Cyclops. Yes. For yeah. my heavy sports, which I got it wrong last game and thought that they couldn't charge but that was a completely different unit that I was looking at. <laughs> so I can actually do something, because I'm, I'm going to attempt to do that, some anti-tank with them. Okay. But we'll, we'll see. Let's see, yeah. I've got an artillery tertio with three multi-laser rapiers and two quad mortar rapiers with shatter shells. Okay. So again, a little bit more anti-tank and multi-lasers are just so incredibly cheap. Yes. 35 yeah. points each, like six shots twin linked. Nothing to sniff at, I don't think, until they do nothing all game. <laughs> and then I've got three Lehman Russes in um, my Armoured Tertio, which is all just separate Russia, Russes in Vanquishers. Oh, oh not in Vanquishers. They're, they're Vanquishers, so they've got... Two, it's two in, shots, isn't it? Yeah, oh, yeah, two shots. They've got an autocannon coaxial, just as standard. Yeah. And they've got las cannons on the hull. Yeah. Okay. That's, that's my army. That's my two, 2,500 points. You're the combat army. I've got I've got the Ogrins on one sword. <laughs> that's my, well, because I've my got combat. five power weapons. <laughs> so yeah, yeah, that is, we 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 know who's winning the close combat. <laughs> well, it's, uh, surely you you've got the Ogrins. Well, we'll it's see. It's so much better for that one combat that we have all game. We'll see how long they last. I might have to let them live now just to <laughs> just to show what they can do. But we're going to be playing Dominion and we're going to be playing Dawn of War because last time we played the triangle, so the the diagonal. 
Deployment. Okay. Last time I played that, so we're going to play Dawn of War this time. If you like watching the game, don't forget to hit like, comment below, subscribe. Basically, it lets me know in the analytics that you guys like this sort of stuff. Um, if you really like it, you can subscribe to the Patreon and get yourself a bounty tray, as well as access to the Discord, and we will get into deployment right now. This is us after deployment, and we have a central objective, an objective, basically, for cornering the central objective. Yeah, it's better Yeah, let's not go into it any more than that <laughs> because my descriptives are failing me today. So, where have you deployed, Rich? I basically just deployed right across the board. <laughs> mainly, mainly, nice and succinct. Done. Well, mainly because the, the, the way the tercios work, you've got to be three inches apart. Yeah. Um, so, it, it sort of cramps you up, but because there's so much stuff and... You, we're both going to have to get to at least the halfway point yeah. of the board, really, to try and stop the other scoring. So, um, so yeah, the only the only sort of clever bit that was a bit too far away. Um, well, I was going to pick you up on that. Was, <laughs> it was a Matthew Russell two inches. Um, it was just putting the ogrins in the middle because they're. Well, that was basically the big thought. Of yeah, the and, and everything else is where it, where it would fit. So, um, well, you've also tried to keep your um, your artillery next to your command squad, aren't you? Well, you say that. What I did was put them there and then I realised it was a good idea and then I realised that the other artillery squad with low leadership was absolutely miles away. So the actually, they actually need to deploy close to them because they're in the same tertiary, don't they? And I've done that exactly the same as well. I've done that wrong. Well, that helps me out. So we'll come back after we've changed <laughs> that. So swiftly redeployed, we now have the two artillery se sections and mine, I also transgress. Yep. Next but mine are now all leadership nine. What a great idea that was. Excellent. I did, I did not go with that <laughs> smart plan. So yeah, over to my deployment. We've got three LAS rifle sections here in the one to Tertio one, we'll call it, I suppose. Yep. Ringing the command section to get that. Well, I suppose they've got leadership 10 anyway from the command box. But it allows me to just push up on this side. I've tried to hide from the Volkites a little bit. My... Russes have all gone at the back to move off independently in a second. Obviously, command squad with my companions lining to basically try and get the usefulness into the centre because I don't know where to go with them yet. There's nothing to like sort of decapitate other than your command squad at the back. I've then got my Velataris Tertio in the centre because you know they're the heavy storm troops, was my <laughs> thinking. <laughs> <laughs> I've got my demolition vehicles here, which are them and their operators. I've all got to start in coherency, so they've got to be two inches away, and then they can move off independently, all six of them. <laughs> then I've got the last rifle section on the left-hand side to basically mill forwards and do some stuff and some things. Going to be entertaining. Yes. So, Rich deployed first, so I'm going to attempt to seize. Neither of us wanted night fighting, right? No, uh, quite happy without it. <laughs> okay. We're not going to hit a barn door if we do. No. 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 Well, you've got augury scanner, so you might actually be able to shoot. Oh, yeah. But, <laughs> there we go. And seize! Boom! Every time. <laughs> of course. And we'll go into Solar Auxilia. Or Thorokite Auxilia. Turn one. So, Thorikai Auxilia turn one, and I've got to sort of move carefully to keep out of the way of stuff. So all my demolition charge vehicles act up in completely independently now. So they're just gonna start by going forward their sixes. I don't know why I'm measuring each one individually. They started on the line, so they can all move exactly the same amount of inches. What toughness are they? Um, We'll get to that in your shooting phase. <laughs> I have no idea. I'm going to move four inches with this unit here. See how nice and easy that tray is. Ooh, you're going to have such a horrendous time. Actually, you don't have to do it with one hand. <laughs> so, I don't feel too much sympathy, actually. So my Velataris, or my Heavy Flamers, are going to move six inches and they might decamp, do they decamp this turn? Go straight for that objective. No, no they don't. <laughs> Not yet. Oh, I just thought I'd want to. Um, my companions are gonna roar off into the distance and bomb up an entire 12. 
to this point here. Just because I sort of need to get their melter guns into the game, otherwise they're going to be completely <laughs> useless. And the other, the other squad will do exactly the same. My... Oh, I'm going to start taking difficult terrain tests for these. So the Velotaris squad's Aurochs on the left is going to move up. Oh! oh and it immobilises itself as soon as it hits the woods. And one loses, inch forwards. Loses a whole point? Loses a whole point. Yeah. So they, that will have two whole points left. And I'll just get out that squad now because <laughs> why the hell not? <laughs> so they move. That squad moves four inches forwards and gets to here. Moving through the woods. Jesus. There we go. So they're about an inch forwards, if you <laughs> remind me next time, just because they're slippy. In fact, there. They can be secured by the squad behind. Teamwork. And I'm going to attempt to not immobilize the second Orox. Great time for a one. <gasps> no. <laughs> so that's going to go six inches forwards and decamp to the side. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm not going to decamp, decamp yet. But I am going to move six inches forwards with my LAS rifle section here. So that will ignore the close order drill. So I won't be shooting heavy stuff this turn. But what I will be doing is scoring an objective hopefully next turn. If you're still there? If, if I'm still there, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm hopefully going to give you some target saturation where you, don't you can't decide what to shoot at is the plan. But let's see if that works out. It has a way of going wrong. My Velotaris and my LAS rifles on this side are going to move up there three because I want to fire their heavy weapons this turn. And the squad over here, which is nicely behind cover, is going to do the same, just moving three. My command section are feeling like massive cowards. Massive, massive cowards. So they're just going to... They're going to start moving up this way, but they're not going to do it too fast, you know? They're going to just... Just get there. Just get there. My Russes are going to split off and move to here. Oh, they've not split off. They, they're already split, but they're going to move in yeah. separate ways. You know, words and things. My rapier carriages have got four inch movement. Are they relentless now? They are relentless yes, now. I, so. I thought they were. Which is an incredibly, incredibly useful rule with them. And they've got 36 inch range, haven't they? To chatter, yeah. Yeah. So hopefully, because you're deployed 12 onto the board, I'll have some targets. If not, I'll be firing frag uselessly at your <laughs> void hardened armor guys. Next, my other Russes. Gonna just swing round. So I'm mm. mostly terrified of those Volkite tanks over there. Which are which are actually really, really scary. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. Uh, there's not even a good thing. To, he's gonna just stay there and pivot to, the, to there to have a shot on the Malkador. Yeah, because God, what what am I doing this turn? I don't know. This Duders are gonna move there three inches forwards and get to here so I can fire my Lars rifles at full effect. And these guys are going to do the same. And the, not the Vox operators, the demo charge operators <laughs> are just going to all scatter <laughs> to just stay in, in line of sight of their demolition vehicles. That is my movement. And yeah, so into shooting, are you ready for this? <sighs> Come on, let's, just get, it, turn, let's get it over with. First turn to react this turn. So I'm going to start with some multi-lasers. I'm going to snap fire the multi-lasers here. Yep. I'll just do both at the same time. Oh, no, I won't. The first one's going to snap fire into your Ogrins. Okay. Do you want to react? Yeah. No. So, <laughs> are you going to react if I do a second unit? Uh, probably are you going to react to the second snap fire multi-laser? <laughs> <laughs> probably not. No, I'll just do them all at once. Yeah. <laughs> Two hits! Yep. Yeah. 
No, because ah. they're pin tool ones. Ah, right, so okay. Yeah. They're strength six, your toughest five, so yeah, three. Three, four. Two wounds. So four up, and they have five up, feel no pain. Yes. Oh, sorry, yeah, yeah. So one's Ooh. okay, I feel no pain. No, so one's wounded. I think mm. they have three wounds each, but I'll check that. Yes. Uh, next, I'm going to fire my my multi laser from here. Yep. So that's going to do exactly the same. In fact, all three multi lasers are going to fire into your Ogryon, so you're going to react to any no. one of them. <laughs> no. <laughs> so that looks like too many shots. Five, ten. That was ten dice. Oh, that was a terrible roll as well. Yeah, you got three hits. What do you want me to do? Just, yeah. just take the three hits. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're taking the three hits on that because Rich wants to preserve that terrible roll. <laughs> Not that it's been completely fair enough. <laughs> like that. <laughs> Probably the best way to do it. So they wound on threes. Ooh. Three. So, fours. Duh. Oh, three fails. Feel no pain. So, one is dead. Because he's got. Did you look it up? Do they have three wounds? I didn't yeah. look it up. I'm fairly certain it is. I will check it while we do it. Okay. So while you're looking that up, I'm going to. Yeah, three wounds. Awesome. So I'm going to fire Laz rifles here into your Laz rifle squad in the trees on your far left. Okay. So I'm going to start with the squad on the right. Yep. Just going to fire 20 shots because they're heavy too. Yes, yeah. Strength yeah. three. And they're definitely in range, it's 30 in range. Oh, is it th oh, yeah. I think they've been reduced. Yeah. It used to be 36. And <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, oh, so four, four hits. <laughs> oh, successful shootings. So four from the first 10. Oh, yeah, it's double that, isn't it? Yeah, yeah don't, oh, don't get too excited. Five, six, seven. <laughs> yes! Crack shots today, complete crack shots. And then they wound on fours because you are squishy humans. Uh, so I wound four, four times. Oh. Thank you very much. Um, so just four, four up saves, there's nothing yeah, else. Yeah, on the squad in the woods. One dead. Hey, we'll take that. <laughs> my, um, ooh, so he takes the one at the back. My squad here. Yep. He's gonna fight your Laz rifle squad there. Okay. Yeah. Cause just because that's basically all I can see. So I'm gonna hit on fours again. So I get four hits from the first batch. Underneath. And how many from the second batch? Oh, that's better. Ooh, seven from the second batch, so 11. 11. Yep. Which is, will be the right amount of dice because of... There we go. So that was very convenient, the right amount of dice. So wound on fours, and not many wounds from that. Four wounds. So same again, four yeah. ups. One dead. Yeah. Oh, he's very good at passing that. I'm gonna snap fire. The squad. Oh, it's on this squad over here. Oh, sorry, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and this one. Um, just take a dude out. From so one back. from the middle. I'm then going to snap fire these guys. They moved their six, so I've got to snap fire because they're not using their club's yeah. order drill. So 20 shots hitting on sixes. Nothing from the first. Oh, that was 11. <laughs> <laughs> I need to get rid of that extra dice. So one hit. This is how Max wins games. Just took a few extra dice in now. Yeah, ran, <laughs> randomly put it there. The dice is removed from the game forever now. So it was one hit. One wound. Ah, oh, ah, oh, so terrible. Good to go. So unfair. Next, I'm going to fire with my quad mortars here and they're going to fire into your left hand yep oh my left so your right ah, okay yep yeah so i've got eight shots between them would i it's uh, one unit you what, will get a, a six up save yeah because intervening is always six and yes yeah. well it's any, so, anything for a vehicle six at yeah. best isn't it so you're definitely yeah i'm i'm pretty happy to go <coughs> with you're pretty much always getting a six really yeah <laughs> so I'm going to hit you on fours. Yep. And it's not twin linked, is it? No. So that's all right. Well. So it's four hits. And then you're fives, aren't you, with a reroll? Yes, because you're 13 on the front with some. Yeah. So one. One pen, yeah. Two. So one glance, one pen. So do the pen. No. no. The glance. No. no. So what does the pen do? Snap fire him. So do you know that, <laughs> do you know that demolish cannon that you pay for? Oh, you're okay. right. Yeah. 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 Yeah, useless. Yeah. 
So useless. Next, I'm going to go with my last rifle sections over here. So the front one moved six. Into these guys. I'm yes, sure. into your yep. last rifle. So this front one moved six, so a snap firing. Yep. Are you going to react? No. <laughs> so they hit. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> they hit more than some of your um, your good squads. Yeah, five hits from the first batch. That another four. <laughs> another four. So fifty percent. Yeah, not quite. Like Forty-five percent. Mm. That, that was crack troops. You just remind me why I don't play you very often. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's hurtful. And then six wounds. These might be the best, best in the entire army. Uh, six wounds, was it? Six wounds. Yeah, see, this is where I miss the medics. I always used to have medics in the rifle squads, but... Well, it's because they've gone to feel no pain six. Like, it's just not the greatest. So, yeah, two. So that's not bad. But, yeah, it's... They're still quite cheap. Uh, it was this squad, wasn't it? Yes. Um, but lots of squads, very confusing. <laughs> He's, I think part of the trouble is we've got lots of squads that look identical and yes. are functionally yeah. identical. So my squad behind that moved three... Yep. ...are going to fire into the same squad. So they're going to be hitting on fours because they've got close order drill with their heavy weapons. Yep. Which I know you already know, but <laughs> you don't know. You say that. So fours, four hit, four hits are less than the snap firing squad. And the second amount, oh that's, oh, that's good. So seven, so 11. Ton. Yep. So 11 wounding on fours. Four, six, seven. So exactly the same amount of wounds as the snap firing squad. <laughs> so four ups. Ooh. Oh, two. Two. Yeah. Sorry, You've been I... hot on these Laz rifle saves. It's the, the Empress Children dice, I told you. They were, they're good, or well, they've been good. Uh, two. So I've not actually forced any panic checks up to now. I'm next going to fire with my multi lasers on the hill. Okay. And they're going to fire into... What's the range on multi-laser now? 36. Oh, is it? I thought yeah. it was 20. It used to be 24, didn't it? So in the name of not killing too many Ogrins so that they can get into combat, I'm going to fire at your Laz Rifle squad. This Prevent one? some scoring. Yeah. This one, yeah. Now, the way that I'm positioned, I'm actually car parked in, so I can't see anything. So only one multi-laser can actually see that unit. Okay. So I hit you on fours. And they are twin linked. Yes. Ah, right. So I get five hits and then I wound on twos. Twos? Because they're showing six for multi lasers. Yeah, toughness five. Oh, it's nice right. <laughs> Not firing into the <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He's been a long day, Rich. He's been a long drive. Um, how, how many was it? Four. Four. So four. So just four, four ups. Ups. Ooh. Ooh, three dead. Terrifying multi lasers there. Um, one, two. Three. Next, I'm going to fire with my Vanquisher here. So that's got his Vanquish cannon, coaxial auto, auto cannon, cannon yeah. and um, hull mounted Laz cannon. Okay. So coaxial weapons, if you fire them before the main weapon, you get to re-roll it to hit, don't you? Yeah, twin link. Um, so I'm going to fire with the auto cannon first. Okay. I'm, I'm going, going to fire into your Russes. I'm going to shroud. Are you? Okay. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, I am, because there's no yeah. point firing back. Oh, and it's worth saying right now, because you're about to do it a second time when I fire the next Russ, we both pick Stoic Defender for our Warlord trade, didn't we? So we yeah. both get two reactions in the shooting phase, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. because there's not much I want to react to in the assault phase, <laughs> essentially. So yeah, Coaxial Auto Cannon. Hits once, yeah, so I get to reroll my battle cannon. So you need a six to see if it does anything, because it rends, doesn't it? Oh yeah, it does. No. But I do get to reroll the hits with the Vanquisher yeah. now. But I don't <laughs> need to. You know. So strength nine with Sunder. Yeah, uh, is, 14. Yeah, so, you need so five. Five two nines. So one pen. So one pen. We're, we're both six. amazed it was only one pen. So five up. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so, oh yeah, shrouded. Oh, I've, I've actually got a cover save. I was just gonna nicely just be like, oh, I just go. For it. <laughs> so one at the tank on your right has a cover save. So because they're a squadron, I think it's any any unit gets cover. It's a six up. Just go for it. Yes. <laughs> no. No. And then a five up shrouded. Yes. Oh, no. no. So don't, what does the pen do? It. do? Don't do it. I'm mobilised. I'm mobilised. We'll take that. And you can actually then move away because it's a squadron, can't you? you can I think you still so, do yeah. That? These, these are five or four. 
Uh, definitely not five. <coughs> Excuse me, Dave. Dive off camera. <laughs> I'll check it in a minute. Yeah, I couldn't remember because. Yeah, Jacosins are four, aren't they? Yes. Yeah. Five, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Um, so my hull mounted LAS cannon misses, of course. Next, my second vanquisher over here is going to fire into the same squadron. Well, I can't, it can't react again. Oh, because it can only react once yeah. in turn. Oh, I forgot about that. The coaxial auto cannon goes first and misses. Ooh, so I don't get to re roll the vanquishers, which both miss. Go on, the boys. And the whole LAS cannon misses. <laughs> Rubbish. Rubbish. He needs his tank taken off him. Next, here. I can only see your Valdor. Mm. I can't actually see the same squadron. So he's gonna have to be the Valdor. He will also shroud. I imagine. He's so. got a flare shield, which is the one thing we've got to remember. Yes, but you're still only 14 on the front yes. line. Yeah, yeah. So coaxial. Two hits. Yes. So uh, 14 on the front, I need the rend. Yep. No rends. But I get to re-roll this vanquish shot that's shooting now. So one re-roll for the vanks, two hits. Strength nine with Sunder. Needs no. that Sunder. No, oh, still nothing. Waste, without that flare waste, shield. Waste of trout. But well, I've still got the whole mounted last oh, yeah. oh yeah. Which hits. Sunder. Strength nine, Sunder, yeah. No. No. <laughs> oh, and I think that's actually. I'm going to declare my Volkites into your Ogrins and they're out. All right, okay. <laughs> they're they're thanks, out of range. Thanks for that. <laughs> I'm just going to say it. I'm just going to say it. All right. Um, I'm searching for something that I've got left to do, but there's nothing. I so know. it's over to you, that, Rich. That was a lot of shooting. <laughs> well, right. there's a lot of ineffectual shooting. No. Immobilised, so still firing. Yeah. And no leadership tests. No, no. I'm happy with that. Yeah, so over into Solar, other Solar, turn one. So into not my Solar, turn one. Rich, what are you doing? Um, Moving up. Wave after wave. Um, I'm just seeing how far, because I, I, I think I want them to move three inches, these guys, and shoot. Yes. But I need to get... To get into that ineffectual LAS fire war that we've really got <laughs> going on. Where only, what was it, like six casualties? What's the no. Oh, no, more than that, eight casualties. What I was thinking about was having enough men in range of the objective. But in this edition, I can now take off who I want. Yeah. So, so you just take the one of the squad. Yeah, yeah, so that's a big thing. Um, these guys, I think, are going to have to move six. So that's the central LAS rifle squad. Oh... Because what you were saying off camera was that, just like while you're doing this, your Ogrins are 14 inches away from my companion squads in the centre. So it's sort of going to, my decision of reactions is going to come down to where they go, I think, because I need to reverse away from them. And I wait for it, wait for it. We are going to, He moves yeah. it, he moves it, and he reacts. I'm going to move. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to I'm going to reverse with my nearer companion squad. No problem. Yeah. So that leaves a... I think we measured it before. Oh, yeah, can you I'm, I'm, seven, I'm seven inches how away. How far are you away from this one? Oh, nine, I would think, yeah. Nine, yeah, nine inches. So I'm actually just going to reverse to on top of the objective. I'll just turn it to get in. So 10 inches or nine inches. We'll yeah. see, we'll see how brave. Or... We'll, see, we'll see, we'll see which one you knock out of the transport. Just to make sure, yeah. Because that's 36 inches as well. So mm -hmm. over here, these guys are gonna do. So they're moving there, they're not running, but they're moving at full speed. Which oh, I know. I was moving three, but it's minus two for yeah, cover, isn't it? Two, yeah. yeah. So, so in which case, one in the woods. So which case they're going to move four? Because um, that was three, so I'll go a bit further up. I remember you've got to be one inch Cotswold oh, coherence. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Very good point, and because they can only, yeah, yeah, that's right. Um, this is. Oh no, he's not just going to bomb on. Go on, because bomb on. He's snap firing. Stupid thing, snap yeah. firing. So we're just going to come out to here. 
Oh, you're protecting your Velatari. There's nothing. There's nothing he can do. There's nothing. Not not with these. I don't even know what they do, but I guess they're minging. Uh, we didn't look it up. So it's, it's one explosion. I think it's strength ten armor vein. Yeah. But with Sunder, I know. I, I believe ordinance. Right. Okay. Like so, do you know? Like he's, he's good for a hit. He's good for a hit. Right. I'm just brutal a few as well. I'm just checking all my quads are in range of the vehicles. Remember, they've got. Uh, relentless as well. Yeah, well, I don't think I need to move because I've got an absolute shooting gallery of tanks and troops of really high value war rocks <laughs> to go. Well, it's more getting the people out to, to yeah. do other things to them. Right, I think that was it because there's nothing else really needs to move or do anything mm. or can move. I don't think so because everything's everything's about to let loose in a cannonade. <sighs> The Volkites are 15 inches, aren't they? The Volkites are, yeah. Yeah, so... Oh, so whether or not you're going to pop out. Yeah. One that that front squad is going to So you, did you only move six inches? Yes, yeah, yeah. Because I wanted to shoot, because that's the one that can shoot. Ah, yeah. Fair enough. So... I think they move six, don't they? Oh, yeah, yeah. Velatar is six inches. You get a bit more because you have to put them by the door, don't you, and then move them out. So yes, yeah, yeah. So, so you'll get the like inch of the like seven. Yeah. Oh, I never thought of it like that. Actually, I've always just measured six off the vehicle. Matt Russell again. Very. I always very learn. Sneaky. Always learn off Matt Russell. Yeah. So that's the front. And everyone else is going to be in range. But it'd be interested to know what you actually go for with them. Do you shoot into my Cyclops and disappoint me that I don't get to use them? Well, what toughness oh. are they and do they blow up on you? They don't blow up anymore. Right, okay, that's disappointing. But I believe they toughness five. Right. And okay. we'll look it up as soon as I put the camera down for a second. No problem. Right, I think shooting. Right, so, so they're toughness five with two wounds, three up save, and they will hit your things. Your, I should know, Dracosin. I'm not going to have to learn that name, to be honest, because I'm never going to use them. And I'm going to shoot three different units at them, because they're three different... Yes. Yeah. Well, if you if you want to take out the operators, you can also do that, but they're also three different units, so... Ah. So what happens, if, what happens if I kill one of the operators? So each operator can detonate one Cyclops a turn. So I can't detonate all three unless... Ah. So, like, they don't have, they're not reliant on their own, or, ah, uh, their right, own okay. Cyclops, but... Each turn, one Cyclops within line of sight of an operator can be detonated. Okay, right. I think he's the best way of rephrasing Games Workshop's way. Right, okay. So I'm just going to stand my sergeant back up. <laughs> Even if that remained incredibly confusing. <laughs> right, okay. Well, I think we're ready for shooting. Okay, so I'm going to store up my reactions. But do I go with evade or do I go with return fire? Well, I'm going to do the Volkites into this squad. Oh, into my last rifle squad? Yeah. Can you see them? I would say so. Cool. In Let's and out. I think the, the, the cover won't matter, will it? Yes. Um, so it'll be 20 shots. I'll do okay. two lots of 10. Hitting on threes because these are the good the good ones. Okay. Crack tree. Oh, I sh so should I have evade? Probably not. So yeah. six hits. Yep. Yeah. And then the next ten. I think six again. Yeah. So twelve. Dice. Twelve hits. So wound on twos. Yeah, wound on two, strength five, onto my toughness three. Oof. So ten, so ten wounds. Ten, ten Volkite wounds. So ten four up saves. Ten four ups. Uh, uh, gets four wounds, four so wounds, four. So four D flags. So four more, uh, three more, three. So three four ups, one more. Mm. So five total dead. Yeah. Yeah. So five dead from that squad. So, so the only squad <laughs> we just realised in. Ooh. Yeah, the only squad next to the objective. So you're going to become prime targets, I imagine. <laughs> Well, I've got a handful of um, the companion Les rifles, and I think. And can, you can see over this. I, I think I can, see, I can see one. I can only see two, and right. there's four that can see. Okay. But they 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 hit on threes as well, don't they? Yeah, because they're veterans basically. Yeah. Six, eight. So what did I say? Four. So yeah. um, two shots because they're heavy. Yeah. So hitting on threes. 
<laughs> oh, that wasn't great. Two hits. I'm wounded on fours. I thought you said you were rolling well today. One wound. One. Oh, you're gonna fail this One now. four up. Oh, loves it. Um, loves it. So I'm, to I'm gonna fire my squad. Uh, they, they're only snap firing though. They are. Because they move. So three, eight. So. Um, I'll do, do this, I'll, I'll so do this twice. So it's yes. eight, eight shots hitting on sixes. So she moves so, squad in the trees. Not, uh, two. two from the first one. Yeah, sorry. And then another two. two. So four hits. Ooh. Um. <laughs> one wound. So one four up. Loves it. Loves it entirely. Gonna have to, I'm gonna have to get a template out. I'm gonna fire my Dracosin. The Dracosin at the front is gonna fire his blast here. Um, and we'll yeah, see, here we go. Hits. Hits, so hits four. So you wound on twos. Oh, I need to remember to, I've not remembered. <laughs> so two. two wounds. And I've got two cover saves of six up. No. I need to start remembering, I'm forgetting the reaction now comes as you declare. So two from the furthest away, leaving three in the squad on the objective. What I'm gonna to have to do is these guys who move three are gonna to have to shoot at them. Okay. Because barring a, a tray. Yes. I think they're good. So three, six, ten is eleven. So okay, three. and I will I'll evade from this. Uh, yeah, I'll evade from this. No worries, I've got No no you're snap firing, aren't you? No, these these guys move three. Oh did it right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah both both evade. these units move three. So that's twenty shots. Yeah. Twenty two. Twenty two. So first half. Um, six hits. Six, yeah. Yeah. And, two. and then the second Same ten. Again. Oh, the second eleven. Yeah, yeah, because there's eleven guys. Ooh, that's not so good. Six, four, four so, ten. So ten total. Six, ten, yeah. So um, wounded on fours. Mm, pretty good. Uh, seven. We oh, six wounds. Six wounds. So six four ups. Oh, that'll be the squad dead if I don't save a lot of these. So five evades. There's three dead and that's the squad gone. Oh, I say it. Yeah, yeah so I saw the man behind. I thought it'd be easy. No, operator. no, that's the operator of the demolition vehicle. Oh, well, that's, that was a lot for one, for stopping you have one victory point, but I'll yes. take it. Um, hey, it was, that was a lot more effective than my turn shooting. <laughs> so I don't think you can complain too much. I'm going to go with the Valdor into the big Russ on the top of the hill. Okay, I will evade with that. So it's just two shots, um, hitting on fours. Yeah. Ooh. So it's strength it's... 10, ordnance, it's the neutron beam. Yeah. So it hits uh, handy. So first hit. <laughs> Does nothing, because it's 14 front. And the second one is a glance. Oh, so you needed to pen to make me snap fire, right? So, would you say I get a six up cover from like yeah, stuff? Yeah, can do. Yeah. Yeah, there's some So six up cover and then the five up evade. Oh, the glance goes through. So yeah. painful, so painful. That's that's the worst. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> Where are you doing with your you've got your quads and your volkites basically, haven't you? Yeah. And I suppose this last rifle squad. Yeah. Um hmm. We'll go. Yeah, because I'm not I can't take off that objective. I'm just looking over here, because in theory, oh my, are they so this a scoring the, unit in there? No, it's not, it's companions. Okay, so what I'm going to do, have you got a big template? I do. Because the first quad unit is... Do you hear that, Chris Vect? I do, in <laughs> fact, have a large template. I'm going to barrage. Yes, please. Um, so that will get all ten of them. If you hit... Oh, of course you do. So this is the back quad. Yeah, and where does service. that flip to? Uh, oh, sorry, it's two shots, isn't it? Um, so he flips off and gets nothing. Yeah, nothing. So this is going to wound on twos and it's shred. It's strength five shred. Right. For the frag. Oh, so you didn't frag. Is the frag shred now? I think Ooh. so. We can, we'll double check it off. So they do in fact have shred, which was right. So twos with a reroll. Oops. Twos. Not that you need the reroll. Oh, there you need the reroll. <laughs> oh, I still get it. So nine. And it's AP5, isn't it? So you, you'll yeah. get your save. So nine four-ups, of which four die. 
that's not nine as well. So four die, and then I've got another two dice to roll. Oh. So five die. Okay. So you're gonna do that exact same thing again? I don't think I am. Oh really? You're gonna attack them with something else, are you? No, I don't know. I need to kill. Um, so the other quad, so who's in here? Both companions, they're both both melt of companions. Yeah, ones. so I'm gonna go into there with the front, with shatter shells. So that's direct fire, so I will get okay. a six or cover. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. So eight shots. Yeah, hitting on fours. <laughs> Not very good, two hits. So let's take those. And away. you can't explode me, which means at least for me, you can't get me out. So threes with thunder. <laughs> both needing the thunder. <laughs> oh, one glance. Six right. up cover. Oh, oh. A waste of my time. <laughs> um, I wanted that to be wrecked and then those guys shoot at them. Um, so you've got your... Oh, you've still got your culverins. Oh, you dead. You've all I've got, I've got this unit and my Russes, I think, are the only things left to shoot because everything else around here is shot. Mm -hmm. I need them to fail a test because I don't think I've got anything else that can shoot at them because I can't see through the building. Um, ah. Cool. What I could do, because they only moved the three inches, so they could yeah. fire their heavy. Heavy six at the companions. Yeah, the strength six. Yeah, heavy. Are they all? Yeah, they're all in range. Um, mm. But that might be a disproportionate. <laughs> no, we'll, we'll go for it. So there's three, five. Uh, so this is the heavy oh. one shots at strength six into the companions' is Aurox. Yeah, because it's 11, isn't it? 11 on the side, yeah. So I've got uh, 12 shots. Yeah. Hitting on fours. Not the best, but no. still enough to do it. The dice have gone away from me here. There's no sunder or anything on these, is there, sadly? No. So I need... I need two fives or sixes. Yes. Oh, oh he gets two sixes. Two, two pens. pens. But you can't explode me. So no, so it's just I rest. just get out three. Yep. And a ret there. So I will decant them and come back. So that's my squad decanted here. And they're hiding behind their transport and the building so that they don't get deflagged to death by the stupid volcanics <laughs> on the tank. So what are you doing with them, Rich? The stupid Volkites are going to shoot at this Velotari My Velotari squad. Now, the only thing is, so the, the turrets are fine. Mm. That lad's cannon's fine. It's whether I've got arc. I think, uh, you tell me, I think that's probably just <laughs> out, wanna, Do you want to shoot the culverins first, or the, shoot the Volkites first, and then we'll see if it matters? <laughs> we can do. So five, six, uh, ten, so it's eight shots each. Yes. Ten, twelve, so sixteen. Eight, 12. I'm not sure this is going to entirely matter. Um, it hits on fours though. Yeah. So it's well, we'll see. Based on some of the dice so far. Oh, not the best roll, you're right. Um, not, right. not the worst, but. Uh, yeah. 10 hits. Wins on twos. Well, this is the one, being as I've rolled a load of ones so far. There we go. Uh, eight. Eight. And what AP is it? Uh, five. I th well, well. I'll just double check it, but I'm fairly certain all the Volkites are AP5. If it is AP4, that'd be wonderful. <laughs> but I don't think it is. Wonderful. It will be a disappointing day for me if it's AP4. So AP5, I'm gonna get my four up saves, eight of them. Oh, oh, painful. So five, five, go through. So and then you D flag. Four more. And then four four up saves again. Two more dice, so seven total dead. And then one last cannon. Yeah. Hits. Hits. Yeah, with your Malos dice, so it'll just be a six up cover. Six up cover. Nope. Eight dead. And then your. I think that's out. I think it's. I think it's right. It's tight, but we'll just say it's <laughs> out. Um, just do it. It's a. You reckon? They, it's not going to wipe the squad. Oh, it, it hits. hits. It wounds. wounds. Oh, yeah. There you go. Yeah, there we go. Rewarded for allowing <laughs> you to take the shot. <laughs> so, I think that's the shooting. So there's, yeah. there's a couple of big leadership tests now. There is. So these two dudes left there. So they'll need a test. And then the unit on the objective that got fragged. Which is this one here, there. yeah. They'll need one as well. So the unit on the objective, leadership 10, as uh, the rest of the I should have the box, yeah. Yeah, oh, yes. <laughs> right, so 
Just to explain to everyone at home, the Vox allows leadership of 10 across armies so long as you have the Vox, and so long as you have a command box mm. with your commander in the squad. Neither of us got precision shot, so both of us are going to be taking this Vox off last after the sergeant. So leadership 10, love yep. it. Leadership of the two guys, love it. <laughs> Leaderships. I think I need to take one for the companions, which got might get pinned. Yeah, it's the, you have to do the snap firing one. Yes, yeah, so or pinning, and then the pinning. Any the any time you take a penetrating hit in a vehicle, you have to take a as you see if you snap firing. Right. So I took two penetrating hits. So I take two. I think just one because it's. Oh, right, okay. So so, so pin, snap firing. They love it. No. And the pinning check for being knocked out of the vehicle. No, they love it. Absolutely fine. So I've just got my ogrins. <laughs> We've got various long charges, <laughs> so I can go. I think is that a ten or an eleven? I think that's probably an eleven. I think it's a ten and a half. Right. I and, will. And I've got a ten there, so I'm going to try and charge your big tank with a ten-inch charge. Uh, I'm going to Overwatch because it's, you're not doing any other thing. Okay. So multi-laser hits once. Yep. It wounds. Malos dice, four up. Fine. Uh, of course it gets the six. So we'll use the Malos dice for the charge. <laughs> so you want the ten. That's a ten inch charge. Oh, eight. Yes. So, so you move forward four. I do get my four inch surge move. Um, I've, got to, go, yeah, I've got to go towards the, vehicle, towards the tank, yeah. haven't I? I can't just go. <laughs> yeah, you can't just go like, oh, I'm just going to go the complete opposite direction. No, no. It's another four inches. So I think that's my turn. Yeah, so that is Pretty evil sick. auxilia. You're going to be hard. Rich's auxilia, turn one, done. Yeah. They're fairly effective, I'd say. They're, They're better effective. shooting at other auxilia than they will be at marines, I think is the big thing. Yeah, much better. Yeah. Though mine didn't really follow through with that. No. So we'll get on to... Turn two. Thorakite's turn two. So getting into Thorakite turn two, I score one victory point. Victory score... No, there's oh, no objective on sorry. that side. So yeah, one victory point to the Thorakites. Because I managed to shoot you off that one. Yeah. And they, they clung to it. <laughs> they, they did for dear life. With what the shatter shells did to that stupid Aurox, I'd have been better off fragging, fragging the rest of the guys. Potentially, yeah. yeah, yeah. With how it made me get out. <laughs> so, right. Ugh. I'm going to start with... Do you know what? I don't want to start with anything. I really don't know what to do, actually. So I'm going to move forward three with these guys. I'm going to move forward three to also be on the objective yep. with them. They're within 12 of my organs. Do you so. want to react? Ah, I don't because they move their initiative, don't they? They do. So it's only initiative two. That is not really going to help do. me. So, no, we'll leave that there. <laughs> you sure? I thought I was being clever, but not really. So, I'm going to move a Cyclops directly towards the Ogrins and be an inch away. Are you going to react? Uh, no. Because <laughs> my two inches isn't helping anybody. Not for the first time. <laughs> <laughs> going to do exactly the same? Are you yeah, going to yeah. react? No, there's a couple of dead Ogrins coming up here. <laughs> and I'm going to... Now, do I go for three dead ogrins? <laughs> it would be pretty big. Next, I'm going to move this Cyclops. I think he's 12 away, so I think, yeah, he moves six. To there. Do you want to react? I can't really, because I've sort of blocked myself in. I can, I can pivot and move back a bit. Yeah? But, um, no, no, I won't. No, okay. I fear I'm giving you a Dracosan kill. So my heavy flamer squad Oof. is going to move six to here, and then they're going to get out their six. So my heavy flamers are decanted, and Rich is going to react like an absolute coward. So you're going to go oh, to three was, because you're heavy. I keep thinking. Well, it's they're initiative three, aren't they? So two because you're heavy. Ah, uh, because it's minus one, isn't it? Yeah. yeah so. Brilliant. And it's not, it's, you might still be out of range. I, I don't think everyone's going to be out of range. I fear they're going to have to shroud. 
All right, so that's that's the movement reaction this turn. <sighs> yes. So I'm going to move. Yeah, I, w I wanted about four movement reactions. Four inches up with my Velotaris to here. My second squad of Velotaris that didn't get knocked out of their transport. Yep. The transport's just going to take an immediate dangerous terrain test because it's already in dangerous terrain. They love it. And are literally just going to go two inches and then get straight out. Okay. Onto, directly onto the objective. Yep. So the Velotaris squad is decanted to there. I probably should have moved my Melter Guns first, actually, because they're just going to have to single file conga line down the board now, I feel. But first, my squads over here are going, because I need to do something about your squad on the objective. So how far are you moving? He's going to move six. Ooh, to... here we go, the pacey world of auxiliary combat. Because I, I, I basically, I just need to get on some objectives, just like you. I just need to get on some objectives. Oh, yeah. The command squad is going to do the same. They're going to spread out a little bit more. So the command squad can get to there. And the commander. And then this squad is just going to go up three. So that they can do a little bit of effective shooting. Yep. My vanquishers. This one's going to stay here. This one's going to stay here. <laughs> and this one's going to stay here. And everybody shrouded. My multi lasers. Oh, they really need to start doing something. But the car parked in. Quad mortars. I've got so many targets that they need to deal with. <laughs> oh, I'm going to not do them. I'm going to go to the companions over here who's going to advance six inches. Okay. To the front of that woods. And just get to here hunting for some melter gun targets essentially. And just conga lining, which will hopefully allow my other. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. So they get into there, which isn't the most effective movement for them, but it allows this transport to hop over that immobilized, or the, the wrecked transport. Unless it rolls a one. Yeah, oh. that's what I was thinking. <laughs> so there you go. Six inches. They're just actually they're going to go there twelve this turn. Yep. And get to here and give themselves some options for what to do next turn. Because I don't need twenty melter guns to be deposited right there right now. <laughs> the auxilia detonator people are just going to move <laughs> so that they can detonate things. Do you have to see them? Yeah, they have to yeah. be in line of sight. Okay. Yeah. So because I've got this Aurox there, that was blocking line of sight to the the two on the on my right. Mm. So I, you know, I just had to shuffle a little bit. Yeah, and that's that's all done. What they're doing, I think, because the multi lasers might as well <laughs> just stay where they are because they can't actually move to see anything anyway. So into the shooting phase. I'm going to start with the heavy flamers because I'm desperate to. Are you going to... Do I? Can I see whether you're in range first or not, or do I have to declare? As soon as I've declared. No, I, I won't then, because I, th I think you can I just... Yeah, I'm going to get one or two, I think. So, two. One. Two. So, five. Yeah, and that's. I think that's it. Yeah. I oh, no, this one gets one. Okay, so six. So six, so six wounded on twos, and these ignore armor because it's a heavy flamer. So six dead. But I can only kill the ones in range. Yeah. So, so the ones in range, oh. yeah, we're just them. Um, so just three. three. Yeah, I'll take that. Yeah. Good rule to know. Yeah, I, actually, I didn't. I've never thought about it before until just that no, second. I, I have with um, normal shooting, but yeah, never with flamers. Templars. Yeah. So. Yeah, yeah, I don't mean like I've yeah. never thought about, about a gun, but... So my last rifles here, which didn't run, Yep. they're going to shoot at your Velotaris squad. Okay. So 20 shots coming in, and you're not reacting? No, no. So <laughs> I need my reactions elsewhere, sadly. So that's six hits yep. there. Off the first half? Yeah, off the first half. Yeah. Six. Ooh. And another eight, so 40... Oh. 
Come on, Tom, and another seven. <laughs> <Back> to 30. <laughs> At least there's been no come on maxes. <laughs> yeah, Tom, we see you. And then I'm re-rolling three of these because I only rolled 10 out of okay, the first so that's these are seven. Seven. Nine. Nine. I haven't got enough mouse dice. <laughs> to have to pass all of them all at once. Um, so just nine, four yeah, ups. Yeah, nine, four ups. Fear, fear, I might be struggling here. Ooh. Ooh, eight dead and that's the squad. Yeah, that's that's horrific. That's, yeah. Those four ups from earlier coming back to haunt me. That, that was incredibly effective. Incredibly effective. Why take heavy flamers when you can just take las rifles? <laughs> I think it's the learning point from that exact bit. Next, I'm going to do the heavy... It's non snap shooting yep. from this side. So that's 20 last rifle shots into, into yours. Okay. That's better. <laughs> Two out of 10. Yeah. Much better. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep. So eight hits. Fours to him. Yeah. <laughs> three. Well, hang on. <laughs> Apparently, I can only kill the stormtroopers. Two oh. dead. More than last turn. The Melos dice might have to uh, go here. Um, I'm going to start rolling my snap shooting guys as well while you take them. Yeah, yeah, feel free. So, one hit from the first ten. Oh, four <laughs> hits total. These are these were the ones that did well last time. These are proper good. Four so doing. Four total. Two wounds. Another one. So one dead from the snap firing and two dead from the normal firing. You heard it here first, never move three inches. Snap firing is a new call. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So my companions here are going to fire into the same squad. Okay. So I've got, I've got blast pistols, but they're out of range because they're only 10 inch range. Yeah. But I have got two grenade launchers and three LAS rifles. Okay. So the LAS rifles are snap shooting. Yep. Because I moved. Two hits. Crack shots. Two wounds. Yes. And then two grenade launchers, which are assault weapons. Yes. So one hit, strength six, wounds, and it's AP4 because it's grenade launcher. It is, isn't it? Yeah. Um. Of, of which I didn't say, but I was using crack. Which yes, I, yeah. Which we, both, yeah. which we both knew. <laughs> um... Next, I'm going to snap fire the multi laser from here, yep. which is pintle, so it's all round, yep. into the same squad on the objective. So I hit nonce. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to do my volkites here. And will you check the range actually to your squad on the objective? I'm I'm sure they're out, but it's worth. Yeah, it's fifty. Yeah. Well, you might. You've only got one, one though. Yeah, yeah. So he's he's not going to go through the squad. You're already taking a leadership check. Yeah. I'll go on to the squad there. Yeah. So, I'll just double check, but I think I'm fairly certain you're all in range. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. so four hits from the first batch. Yeah. Staying on threes and four hits. Oh, but nine hits from the second batch, so 13 hits. I should have been, I, I'm not, I'm not going to do it. I should have done some shrouding here. But I'll let you. No, you no, 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 I didn't, because I've, I've got other things. I'll take the three ones. Yeah, so that's seven from the first batch. Oh, that's only half of it. <laughs> no, no, it's, it's, so it's oh, ten wind. total. Yeah. So 10 total, and these will deflag it after your wounds. So, so 10, 10 wounds? Yes. So just four ups. Yeah. Oh, that's good. That's, that's good for me. Six, so six dead. And then six deflags. Twos, so four more. So hang on, one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> this is not looking good. So four more? Four more. Uh, well, we five left in the squad. Hey. Oh, four pass. <laughs> that would be a test for them. So next, I'm going to look at where my companions can actually fire. Just checking, I've got everybody that I should have. Can you fire at a tank? Oh, I can get the tread with two of them. If you hit a tank's gun, do you hit the tank? I don't think so, no. So it's just hull? I think it's hull. I think weapons and antennae, like you can't shoot at people's arms and stuff. If you see them, it's got to be part yeah. of the body. So first, I'm going to do the two more Volkites that you left alive here. Yep. Into, into the same squad. Okay, yep. So, four hits. Of course. <laughs> three wounds. So, three four ups. Two D flags. The D flags, one wound. So, you've killed, hang on. 
We're down to the auger scanner, the sergeant, and was it one moon? Sorry. Yeah. I can't remember, so yes. Yeah, I think you passed it anyway. Yeah. Um, We're down to the three that matter. Yes. So I'm going to shoot my multi laser from here. Yep. At the squad on the objective, because it's only because they couldn't shoot anything else that I was going into that squad. Yep. So three into the squad on the objective. Two hits. Two wounds, two four ups, one dead. Um, yeah, oh yeah. A lot of people <laughs> dead. I'm going to shoot my multi lasers here, which can't see anything else, at your Laz rifle squad. And you, because of you, this, I, only I one saying, can see because of the smoke. Can you see all of mine? Was my question. I think, can you see all three to kill all No, three? only one. Yeah. So I'm in fact going to fire at the Ogrins. Okay. Of which, so I get 12 shots. Yeah. So I'll just get two more. Can I borrow two dice off you, please? You can. Can everyone see through your tank? These two can see ah, sorry, yeah, that yeah, Ogryn. Yeah. And I'm assuming we're not going to kill more than like them two Ogrins. Well, let's, <laughs> let's wait and see. Hopefully. So oh. I'm re-rolling the misses because these are twin links. Okay. So he's statistical, statistical yeah. to start. Oh, and that's bad. <laughs> so much. So I'm wounded on threes because your toughness yeah. five. Oh, only two wounds. So four ups for yeah. the armor. So and one takes a wound. Feel no pain. Yeah. No. So one yeah. wounded. <laughs> Cheers for coming, rapiers. The trouble is they just low, low priority of where to place them. <laughs> Shoot the pintle multi laser at. Your Ogrins again. Okay. Because why not? So two hits, threes, two wounds. Four ups. Uh, Feel the pain. pain? No. So it's Take a wound. And finally, or not finally, but finally for multi lasers, this tank that's on two hull points is yep. going to fire into the Ogrins as I accidentally knock about the hull. <laughs> and two hits. Hey. Oh, double one, no wounds. Ah, what's coming next? What's coming next? My quad mortars. Yep. I really, really didn't want to have to fire them at the troop squads. Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna delay it for a bit longer. Companions of which two are in range. Melt guns. Okay. Into your Valdor. Threes, because these are posh, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah. So two hits. Uh, sixes. sixes. <laughs> sixes for your cover saves though because I'm shooting through them trees if nothing else yeah it's only a glance isn't it two glances yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> through <laughs> I need to check I think he has five hull points but I'll check it in a minute okay so I'm going to fire the coaxial from the vanquisher same time I will shroud yes so one hit yep uh, needs the rend no. can't do it so then I'm going to go with the vanquisher cannon with a reroll for the coaxial, one hit, strength nine, so five 14 on the front, yeah, or oh, 14 because of your yeah, shield. Yeah, flare shield, yeah. Reroll for Sunder, nothing. And then the Laz cannon. Hits. Hits. With Sunder. It's a glance. So it is six up for the cover, five. Five shrouding. Hey. Oh, oh, oh. Worth doing. My Vanquisher here is going to go into your Russes. Shroud in. Yeah, thought so. <laughs> Coaxel, two hits, needs the sixes. Nope. Vanquisher cannon. Got the Coaxel. One hit. One hit. It's strength nine against 14. With Sunder. Yes! So um, you've got five up shrouded. Hey! Yeah, there we go. And from this side, yeah, I'm gonna go the same thing again. So just get a six up first. Yeah, for, of for course. Normal. Yeah, you definitely get a six. <laughs> See, this is where the cover mechanics are a bit weird in Heresy Two. That's like ninety percent obscured. Yeah. I can definitely see. Yeah. But you should be getting more of a cover than a six up. Yeah. But you don't because that's the game we play. So I hit with the coaxial. Yeah. I need sixes to do anything. No. Nope. But the Vanquisher cannon hits once, hits twice, Ooh. five. No, re-roll. No. Oh. And then the hull lads. The hull lads. No. Oh, I needed that. That wasn't great. That wasn't great, I won't lie. 
Next, do I go for the squads and the objectives? Or do I go for potentially... How worried am I about a blooming Dracosan? That's what I've got to ask myself. And the answer's not very. I'm going to go for the squad and the objective. So that's, me there. Yeah, large blast. If you go in the middle, you get all but one. So you'll be okay. getting here. I'll do that. Yeah. So I hit. Yeah, so that's five. And then the flip goes off and gets nothing. Yeah, nothing. So you've got five guys. So twos with shred. <laughs> Ooh, one with shred. shred. You shouldn't have told me about that shred, Rich. So that's five wounds. Oh. Ooh, four dead, leaving two. But two remain on the objective, crucially. Yeah, it's going to have to be. So that's the sergeant and the box left alive. Absolutely. And the sergeant, the box, and the ogre scanner. Yeah. <laughs> <The other. laughs> and that is my shooting phase. Oh, the Lord for that. I'm not doing loads to your like big scary stuff, but I'd say that was quite effective against oh. your infantry. <laughs> the dead pile. Yeah, the, the dead pile. <laughs> I think that was like your first turn on me. So next I'm going to charge. Well, I'll, do, gonna... I'll do my leadership tests. Yes. First. So the one on the objective passes. Fine. And the one there. Oh, runs. Off. Have you got a Vexilla still alive? I've got. Not in the squad. because. Oh, you no, no, no. Ways. The squads haven't got Vexillas. Right. Which, looking back now, so it's just uh, two in. Two yes. Six. Nine <laughs> off the board? No. No, not quite. It was about an inch and a half. But you're below 25%, so you can't regroup. Oh, is that a thing in these? Well, it's not mar you're not Marines. Let's look that up. So they can, in fact, regroup because we can't see anything in the rules that in Heresy 2 it's, that you yeah. can't regroup. There's nothing in falling back. Yeah. About so, 25%. Yeah. Tell us in the comments, basically, so I can know as much as anything. Yeah. Because I, if that's still a thing, that's... Not really important for the objectives in this game. No. But, or I'm right wrong. now at least, but it'd be good to know. So, I'm going to first charge with my Cyclops here into your Dracosan. Oh, I can't do anything. No. Didn't think you could. Six so, inches? I, th I think. Well, it? we'll measure it, Rich. Oh, are you going to cover? Uh, I'm... <laughs> Don't worry about uh, well, it. No, no, we, no. Well, which way do you want to play it? I wouldn't really say. No. I'd yeah. say, like, onto the building and not obviously. Fine by me. Yeah. I think you're six away. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, six. So it's a six inch charge onto the Dracosan. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, so I go three and stop like an idiot. Next, I'm going to do two. I'm going to do a two inch charge first onto your Ogrens. It's not so, going to make a difference because you can't. I always, you only get one attack, don't you? Yeah. So I can't stop you. I just you. explodes and die. Yeah, go on. Yeah. Thing. So I can't overwatch. The you. two inch away one gets in. The one inch away one gets in. Yeah. Okay. So. <laughs> Ooh. They both go into the same Ogryn. <laughs> so. The thing that I was worried about was that I would just blow up one Ogryn with both of them. Well, this is actually done at initiative step, we've just looked it up and found out. So, Rich actually strikes first with his initiative two Ogryns. <laughs> so you get to pile in so, and do a billion attacks on me. I say everyone's going to be in yeah. by the time we've all piled in, because everyone's going to be within two inches of somebody. So, how many attacks do Ogryns have normally? Uh, four. Hit you on threes? Yes. Oh, I should have gone after that Dracosan. Uh, I've used these terribly in two games now. <laughs> I got to <clears throat> the strength when I'm over here. Oh, the claws are strength seven, AP three, rending. You wound me on twos and the rending won't matter. But I've done the, ten. Yeah. So they've all hit, strength seven. Yeah. So you've got... <laughs> How many attacks was this to start off with? Oh, so yeah, this was 10. Because I thought it was right, so, the other, so I've got, I've got uh, six more You've after. got two squads, yeah. haven't you, that you're attacking into? Oh. Yeah, so I'll do the other. I'll just yeah, do, do the, the other six. six into yeah. the other. Well, yeah. he's gone then, because there's yeah. three wrens there. And, and then, then I'll do my other six. <laughs> yeah. Oh. 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 So you wound on twos. If you get a one, it's going to explode it's on you. It's yeah. three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Oh, he's dead. Yeah, he's gone. Oof. Oh, that's terrible. What terrible tactics have you used? 
<laughs> and I get to consolidate. Yeah. Just my two. It doesn't actually really matter. I might go for a multi-charge over here. Cool. Um, yeah. Well, that was glorious. One failed, two. Oh, well, I, did, I thought I automatically went first. Yeah. I thought it just like explodes. But that's what you get for checking the rules. I should have just cheated. <laughs> and that is over to Evil Auxilia turn two. I thought I was the Loyalist. You are, but the Loyalists are evil. <laughs> From my point of view, the Loyalists are evil. I mean, So, over to Loyalist, uh, in Loyalist, turn one. I'm going to try and regroup my boys on a, yes. on a ten. Uh, no, they don't. Well, they they're, I think the they're board. one and a half inches away. Yeah, yeah. Gone. Thanks for coming, lads. <laughs> Save that They've had enough. Thing. They've had enough. So They've what, seen the way the battle's going. What we're going to do is they're just going to move back in within their one inch. Yeah, and um, then moving their, within their three inches, yes. I imagine. For the, <laughs> for the few shots they've got. Right. Um, can I ram your bomb? I don't see why not. Because I'll do D6 hits on it, won't I? Yeah. No, we'll, we'll leave that <laughs> no, for now. No, no. We'll leave that for now. Because what we're going to do is just come... Oh, go on, ram my bomb. Basically, we're just going to move go over on, here. Ram the bomb, ram the there. bomb. And this guy's going to come up. So he's shooting again now. Yeah. So I've got two two Dracosan shots and the <laughs> the Volkite guys want to get out but they want to stay away from those flamers because I don't want you to shoot back um, so in fact I will stay I'm going to stay in there I think I'm going to react to that second one moving the movement react yeah so I'm going to move directly towards you and get to there this yeah. guy is just going to move back a little bit to get out of that horrible melter range and at least make you work. And you can tell Sam Shaw that that is not hanging off the back of the table. If it will. We'll just check. We'll just check. We'll just check. It is not, in fact, off the back of the table. But I'm not sure them trench bits count. That's not, <laughs> that's not part of the hull. Now, what I want to do... They can see the front first few units. The, the, the back one can, that one can't. Right, okay. If I move them, that's still in the way, so there's not really a point. So I can I can frag over there and do something, you potentially. Hope. Yeah. You hope. Oh, these Ogrins are so much scarier now that I've not explodes them. Yeah, I think what we're going to do with them, because you've already done your movement reaction, haven't have, you? Yeah. So we're going to go... Because I think we're going to do a multi-charge over here and try and get through a load of scoring units. Okay. I think I'm an inch away from you, aren't I? Yeah, you, well, we, we know you're an inch away from me, <laughs> I think. Oh, hang on. I wondered what, I what the dice was for. So, you've killed a lot. I had a lot more shooting last time. Um, you had a lot more useless shooting, is what I will say. Yeah. You've got a lot, you've still got all the damage dealers. Right. I kill those heavy flamers. Yeah, I think they're uniquely amazing against other solar. Because <laughs> I don't think marine players would be that scared of them. But I suppose them ignoring armour. Big. Right, I'm going to start with these back mortars. Onto these big piles. Yeah, I can see about here. I can see... So you're putting it onto my command squad? I'm going to go there, over him. Okay. Okay. I'm going to just tank them, yeah. Oh, oh, they're not twin linked or anything anymore, so it's going to be seven, isn't it? Because they're a good seven, three. yeah. So we were over that here. They are. So, so see the flip. Do you, you can put that down? We've got a second template for you. No, <laughs> off on to Thanks for coming. Right. <laughs> and then. Exactly one. the same with the other one? No, the other one can't see them. Um, so, so, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're going to fire your second quad mortars. At. Full scattering at them, and I need to declare my reaction now. I really need to stay on that objective this turn. You've not done. I'm going to evade with them. Okay, so that's your first reaction. That's my first out of two, okay. yeah. Well, let's see. <laughs> Seven inches. Oh, right back into the mix. So it was from there. So it's. I don't think there. that's necessarily going to do anything. I think you get two companions. Okay, and let's see what. The next one flips that way. So I was on. I was on right on there. Right on there. 
so back there. Yeah, and you, so you get the aurochs. Yeah, which I, I guess I can. Do I get any any dudes with that one? Yeah, what's so a one more companion? Okay, um, so how many companions was it? So three total, yeah. and then one yeah. on the aurochs. So the companions uh, with shred. So three armor saves. So three armor saves. They've got four ups, and they've each got two wounds. Oh, one dies. <laughs> Boo. And Boo. then the aura, obviously, it will hit on the side, so it'll be a six. Yes. No. Strength five. It is. Oh, I can't believe you took out a companion with that. No, that's annoyed me, that, because there's nobody else. Um, right, so who have we got? Where's your warlord? My warlord is here. Okay, so we're going to do everything from the Russes into your warlord squad. They're going to evade. <laughs> Four. <laughs> I'm going to... Twelve. So everything can see. So that's, yeah, so you've got... Sixteen. Uh, Sixteen total Volkite shots. And then two life cannons. Right. So the Volkite. Yeah. Oh, no. That's... You know when it's easy to pick up really the, the hits rather than the misses? How many so shots is that? Five. Seven hits. Not bad, not bad. They, they're doubling out. Uh, six. Six. Oh, so I'm gonna start. Ta I'm gonna have to start tanking because you will double out my command squad if I don't tank. So, <laughs> with an evade. So six total into it. With an evade. I've gone too early. Yeah. <laughs> and you accelerated too. Is that all on your warlord as well? Yeah. It? Well, he's he toughness four because they're battle hardened one. Yes. Yeah. So that was in, it. Wasn't the armor save that I was worried about? Yeah. It was in fact the not being doubled out. The last cannons. One hit. Was <laughs> a wound on a one. <laughs> oh no. That might Rich, be um, painful. Um. I fire the Laz rifle, so he's got, he's actually got a, a pistol and a, a combat weapon. Okay. So I just thought I, I, I would have shot him the turn before. So I've got two. Uh, what? Because I, I did like all of them shot uh, rapid yeah. fire. Yeah, yeah. So it was two rifle shots. Are we, right? are we worried about that? No, but. Just, um, did, just, can you, uh, you sat, can they not, oh, they can't carry both. So I've got one mm. Laz rifle, which I'll just go into um, your, the nearest troop squad. Okay. One hit. One wound. Four up. Yeah. I was going to say, if he did more wounds than the Russes. <laughs> oh, right. We'll do the Malkador at that one on the hill again. Yeah, so that one has got three hull points left. Yeah. Have you got no more reactions now? No more. Okay. So, main gun. That's scatter dice. <laughs> it was a hit. So, two, two hits. hits. So Strength the ten. First one. Nothing. <laughs> Second one. <laughs> Nothing. Oh my god, Rich. <laughs> Throw away those dice. Oh, shot the quads. Right, the um I'm gonna fire the, the demolishers. Uh, where? Into these horrible heavy flamers. So can I buy oh, a I small so, blast? I so so hope you scatter directly onto the other one. Well we'll do this one first. Yep. So we're just gonna let okay. you in. Oh it's a hit, even though oh, I've got the wrong amount of dice. Boo. So how many was that? Uh, a lot. Seven. Three. Six. I think, oh no, eight. Eight. Three. So these are, I think they're AP four. The, yeah. The rend on a rend six. On six yeah. And brutal, so twos. So six. Six dead. Yeah. And I'll choose five. Six. <laughs> See, that's all right, because now I'm going to shoot my rifle squad. Yes. Uh, one, two, three, f the ones I forgot to move, but it d doesn't matter, there's some within the objective. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now these have just got, uh, the sergeant's got no weapons. Yeah. So I do eight twice. Yes. Um, hitting on fours. Um, so four hits, and then... <laughs> one hit. So five all together, <laughs> and fours. So three. three wounds. So three, three four. four up. Oh, three dead, leaving just the. Oh, I've got. See, I've got a Vox in the squad and I've got a Sergeant. So obviously, I take the Sergeant and leave the Vox. You can. So I've got one. 
two, three of the companions can see. Okay. And the grenade launcher. Okay. So let's do the grenade launcher. But yeah, because it's AP4. So hits, hits two up to win. So you'll get six up cover save. Up. No, no, he's dead. Pool. So where is the second demolisher going? I think it has to go into that mess on there and try and break. So what's the most I can hit over here? Probably right there, getting nine. If I come over, how many can I hit on both units? What's the... That guy is... Oh, no, no, if I try and hit two units so like you can a lot... Get, uh, not really, you I don't know. Maybe let, get... You let, can get two on one unit. So not enough to force the panic check, which no. is the key. We'll go for the middle of that. So the eight. Yeah, we'll go for the middle of the big so unit. There. Uh, Seven, go four. Four off. Nothing. No. Oh, oh, have a one on that guy. Well, I don't want him. There, he's dead. <laughs> he oh, one. he gets a cover, doesn't he? <laughs> he gets a cover. Just no, to work done. with cover. Uh, yeah, because it splits the wounds before saves. No, but would you have to take three cover saves? Yeah, but he's dead. Yeah, no, that's, that's <laughs> just one that's it's popped up before and I, I didn't yeah. know. That was dreadful. No, yeah, no panic checks for me because everything that you shot at either entirely died or did nothing. So Yeah, so so I think it's just the Ogrins because there's nothing. So who you who are you actually charging into? I'm going to charge these guys. So the Velotaris big squad is your main. But I'm gonna multi-charge the them. As your Yeah. So you're not contacting anything else? No, because I don't want them to shoot at me. Right, so I will tertio overwatch. <laughs> Who's in the tertio? Just so it's just twelve the twelve dudes. Oh, right, I've got okay. to be within three inches. Ooh. Of which I think I just scrape it. Yeah, I'll give it you. Yeah. It's closer. For the extra two guy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, for the for the four shots into the toughness fives. So the first I'm gonna get twenty-four total shots. Threes? Yeah. So that's six from the first batch. Yep. Six plus seven. So 13 yeah. hits. 13 plus a three. Oh no, plus four, isn't it? 13, 14, 15. Yep. And I'm wounded on fours. Yeah. So I'll reroll five. Oh, I don't need to reroll five. <laughs> <laughs> Got seven from the first batch and then five more. Seven, eight, nine, ten. So four, eight, this is a bad idea. So I've got 10 four ups and I've got the feel no yes. pain. Oh, Ooh, that was a good roll. Two fails. Wow, I have a and then feel no pain. Oh, so it does it kill, a wound and kill the wound. You get a D, uh, a D. Uh, oh, a D flag, yes. D flag. Wounded. Feel oh, no pain. Feel no pain. Yeah, fine. Yeah, fine, fine. So um, fine. I will roll a nominal charge just to see how far. Yeah, the loads. So these get Hammer of Wrath 2. <laughs> I think. I'm just going to check that. So Hammer of Wrath 2. Yeah. Rage 2. <laughs> so Hammer of Wrath into that squad off yeah. him. Both dead. Oh no. no I've got my. Yes, you get your arms. So one's one dead. Gone. So the Vox remains alive. And then into the other squad, there'll be. There's two into the other squad. Uh, so four all wounded, wounds. so strength five. So four four ups, one dead. But then, and I'll just keep a track. But then you will go before me. Oh, I do, don't so I? I think you're initiative three and I'm initiative two. Right, so I've got, I've got ten total dudes. Yeah. So that's eleven attacks, because I've only got one sergeant, because the other guy's box. Which I suppose is where that comes in, being necessary to not take off the box. So... 11 attacks, hitting on fours. Oh no, weapon skill four, what weapon skill are I'm you? four, yeah, yeah, so you're on fours. You know what? I've just played fantasy yesterday. The the difference in this table going up to like one. Do you know like oh, this? massive. Yeah. And you'll need Wounded on sixes. sixes. One wound, yes! So yeah. one arm save, I'm feeling no pain. He yeah. loves it, and then the butchery is about to begin. <laughs> I'll do the, the one guy into that squad. Yeah. So they have four base. No. So four. So two hits. Yeah. Twos. Yeah, he's, he's dead. dead. And then, so I'll have 12 into that squad. Yes. Four. Ten. No, so they might not all die. I just might be taking a leadership test on minus nine. Oh, that's not great. 
Only five hits. Oh, so two's to kill. Yeah, so, so five, five dead. dead. So that is a full base. Just entirely dead. So I've lost by seven, because you didn't lose any wounds at all. No. Nope. So I've got a leadership test, I need double one. I'm running. Are you pursuing? Uh, I will do. Because <laughs> why would you ever not? So I get seven. You get more well, common initiative too. Oh, so I actually run away 2d6. Happy days, I run away seven and can regroup, preserving my line. So I actually get to here. <laughs> um, and I will just... You consolidate, consolidate your initiative, two, don't you? Yeah, just my two, just basically stay on that as much as possible. Just block me for a turn, Ooh. essentially. I'm surprised you didn't kill all of them, actually. You had got that terrible to hit roll, didn't you? Yeah, and it was the multi-charge as well, but it's, it's done that I, I would have been quite happy staying in combat. Yeah. Um, but it means, the problem is it's 2-1 now, because I got the two objectives, you got one, but um, yeah. I'm a bit thinner on the ground than you are. Yeah, and we'll see going into turn three. Okay, so Thorakite turn three. Not, actually, we're getting up there in the turns already. I was, I don't know why I thought it would take longer. So, I suppose because there's so many models. I'm gonna start off by moving my Cyclops dem demolition vehicle to one inch away <laughs> from there. Are you gonna react? No, because <laughs> because you can just charge the other one that's two inches away. If I'm on, oh yeah, they're, they're a tertio. Ah, they are a tertio. No, it's pointless. I'm not. I'm not going Vehicles to don't have the tertio rule, so you couldn't actually do. Oh, do they not get that? Oh, no, okay. I thought I thought they did, but I was corrected on that. Ah, right, okay. Next, I'm going to move up six inches with this squad to here, and that will put me. Link just scraping. Yeah. <laughs> and that'll move up six. Command squad moves up six. Six. Oh, yeah. What's that for? Yeah. Whether I actually am or... No, you're, you're just out of 12, because I could have done a movement reaction to get up. I had to move forward to oh, block... Oh, but vehicle, the... vehicles can't contest. Can they not? No, in this vehicle, vehicles can't contest objectives at all. But... Oh, it says it, it says it in the, in the rules, so pointless anyway. Uh, so this last rifle section is actually going to start working its way around here. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm going to move to back up the other objective. Yeah. So I, I think I've got a handle on this one. Oh yeah. Well, like, I might get wiped out in a couple of turns. Yeah, yeah. Or by concentrated fire, but that one is going to go a lot sooner. I actually need to rally my five. Oh yes, yeah, yeah. Velitaris who yeah. love it and want to demonstrate that they are in fact the bigger bodies. I don't think you move anymore, do you? You just stay where you are. I'm happy to yeah. stay there. I'm happy to stay there and not walk towards your Sharon I think your count has been pinned. Someone was telling me this the other day because I thought it was the old three inches oh, snap really? fire, but they would say, no, you're pinned. So basically you can oh. still snap fire, but you can't move. Yeah. Well, I, don't, gonna... I don't know if that's right or not. <laughs> I don't know. don't know if that's right. I'll just say it. Yeah. Um, I'm going to move. Someone else told it me confidently. So it normally means it's right. <laughs> yeah, is that how we... So my Aurox is going to get to here and turn to the side. Is it going to do a train test? It is. <laughs> oh, I've got to I'd, I'd like it move. to stop over the yeah, side. Yeah, yeah, it will as soon as it hits the train. <gasps> no. But I'm... And I'm going to decant and then yeah. after that, you're going to react. Yeah. So I'll decant. So I've moved here to basically... Rich can only react with one unit. So which is one is he going to choose to reverse away with? I'm going to do my pivot and move my uh, six inches, six with, inches with, yeah. with these guys to make sure I try and get at least out of melt range. Okay, so he's got to be any, oh, it can be any direction. Yeah, he can pivot any yeah. direction and then move directly away. So I'll, go, I'll do it from these stupid things. So we're going to there. And, and Russ is a 13 on the side, not 14. I know, but... Um... <laughs> yeah, you're more scared of a melter squad than you are of, of a vanquisher. One of them's immobilised. Do you, do, you... <laughs> do you want to change what you're doing? Um... Yes, I won't. I won't do a movement reaction. Do you want to react with the other thing? Um, yes, that's a, right. a, a great shout. So it will do something similar. It's going <laughs> to try and keep its flare shield. 
Um, yeah, yeah, because if I literally, I try and keep my flare shield at least towards that one, and I'm just going to move back to there because I'm, mm. I'm out of metal range, is the thing. And I've yes. got a bit of flare shield coverage for some of the shots. Yeah, which is what it's all about. So, I'm going to move forwards with my quad launchers. Yeah. I'm going to move randomly there, and then going to move forward with this quad launcher. And that is actually just so I can pivot, <laughs> move six, and pivot into the side Disgusting. of your thing. Dis disgusting tactical play. <laughs> it, it's almost like I planned that from the start, <laughs> but I, I'll admit it right now, I didn't. It's just seemed to have worked out. <laughs> I wish I could have planned that, but I don't have the foresight. So I'm next going to move six inches with this aurochs to there. See, I need to do something about these Dracosans. You don't have crack grenades on, on LAS rifle squads, do you? I don't think so, no. Oh, I sort of need to spread out as well because I'm getting relentlessly shelled by these quad mortars. So I'm going, I'm, I'm just going to move three inches because I can, obviously, with the new rules, you can move and fire. Yep. So fire heavy. Yeah, I'm just going to spread out a little bit, yep. but still we'd be within three inches of that objective. And I think that's me pretty much all moved. The companions are pretty happy where they are, because they, <laughs> like, what are they going to do? It's about a tar anything? target rich environment for everybody. Yeah. I'm actually gonna, just going to turn them, they're going to move their three to just yep. face that way. Um, yeah. <laughs> I just don't know what I'm going to do about the organs really. Unless it goes really good. It, it can do, I suppose. Yeah. So I'm going to start out by firing my melter guns. These guys? Yeah. They're going to fire into the side of your Russes. I'll try out. Will, will you? Are you, sure, yeah. are you sure? So these hit on threes, don't they? Yeah. Shock, shocking, many, shocking. How many melter guns? Ten. Piot. So yeah. I get four misses. Yeah, I'll take that. So six total hits. So just just roll a load and then yeah the first one pens second one oh nothing 13 13 on side so the second one nothing third one nothing fourth one pen yeah fifth one pen that's three pens sixth one pen four pens that's six only six hits. oh yes yeah so so uh, you need to roll them one four at a time total pens so well, you do your shroud. Oh, sorry, yeah, so yeah. Four shrouds. I forgot about that. Don't worry, don't worry, I've got you. Oh. So two passed. So the question is, do you hit the wounded one first? Whatever you want. I think you do, only because I think we checked, or some, I played some, yeah. we checked, so I think it is the damage, like, I think it is like units. Yeah, I'm, it, I'm happy. it really doesn't I'm, matter. I'm happy to go for that. Yeah. So it explodes, <laughs> and it explodes. <laughs> So <laughs> the one that's close, right, the one that's furthest away explodes six, the one that's closest explodes one. So the one that's, <laughs> so, so the best possible way round that I could have rolled that. No, no, do you want to check whether that was within six of anything? Oh, no, 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 right. not even close. I was just annoyed at you and your armor dice as usual. It's the only thing better than you could oh, have saved. So unfair, you've denied my Russ over here something to do. So unfair. It could just go overkill and try and kill those two. I want to charge them to get them uh, uh, onto the yes, objective. Yeah, yeah. Although I suppose then I don't kill them. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna shoot, I'm gonna start off with the two grenade launchers from the command squad. Of one which hit. one hits, yeah. one wounds. Three P4, aren't they? Yeah. Um, the Vox. <laughs> and then, <laughs> so I've got three LAS rifles, which are all gonna fire the double shot because they snap firing because they're heavy. Nothing. What a time for this guy to stay what, alive. Yeah, what a time to be, what a time to be alive indeed. So I'm gonna fire the Pintle, uh, the Pintle thing off the Aurochs. Yep, the multi-laser. Multi-laser, that's what it's called, thank you, Rich. So hits once, just enough. Wounds once, just enough. Ah, he dies. Get out of here, you scrub. Hmm, what's with the fire next? It's all coming up Millhouse at the moment. <laughs> so, so next, my... Russ here. 
Yep. Gonna fire into the front of your Valdor. Um, funny, I'm just gonna have to take this. Like the Are you? Little <laughs> okay. thing that I am. So the auto cannon hits twice, <laughs> does nothing. No. But the Vanquisher cannon of course hits, it hits twice. twice. I'm using all my sixes to hit though. So it's still fives. Yeah, fives. One With glance. Thunder, one glance. Um, was there you a, get a six. I was gonna say a six up. No. You see, I, that's one thing I like about the. Right, so I don't like covers worse. I like how it being worse makes me just go, yeah, just have a cover. Do I just always just let the person have a cover? Yeah, I'm just checking the. Um, the the, whole, the whole points on it, yeah, because I've, I've had it as five. Yeah. But, so um, the last I, cannon misses it. Because <laughs> we could have just wiped out that whole. Whole checking process. Um, yeah, five. Five. Right, so my other Russ is going to have to go into the side. I'm proud. Funny that. If so the auto cannon hits twice. In the side, it's 12 with no thing. Yeah, and I don't think. So seven. So it's a glance. So a glance. So uh, do you. And I don't think there's any. Co oh, so I've shrouded, aren't I? Yeah. <laughs> no. So it does a whole point. The bank is coaxled <gasps> one hit with thunder i get you glance. yeah five up <laughs> he's just glanced and wrecked i'm gonna fire 10 heavy shots strength six into your ogrins okay i've used my shooting reactions yeah. now haven't i because it was that and then yeah so 10 heavy shots into the ogrins hitting on fours oh that's a lot of hits Oh, it's, a, it's an amount of hits, actually. It's yeah. not, not too many. Oh, one wound. Could kill one. Uh, four up. Yeah, four up, then we feel no pain. Use the red dice, he said. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting battered. What can, what can I say? <laughs> so the next squad of ten is going to do exactly the same against the Ogrins. Uh, which squad's this? This squad here. Are they, it's 18, isn't it? Yeah, so 12 is to there. Ah, right, OK. Yeah. They're yeah. So that's six hits. Yep. Threes. So four wounds. Four wounds, yeah. So four ups. That's better. And a five up. No, so. One takes a win, whichever one you want, obviously. I'm going to do ten Volkite shots. Yep. From the Volkites that are snap firing. Yep. Two hits. Fours. One wound. So four up. And a five up. Pain. No, and it's another uh, deflagrate. Oh yeah. Doesn't know. Next, I'm going to do the last rifle squad of five here. Yeah. So they hit twice and wound on threes, two wounds. What? Feeling a pain. No. So he's gone. Yeah. The multi lasers are going to fire into the Ogrins. Who knew? Ooh. So all oh. three can actually see at the moment. Yeah, and the twin links as well. Yeah, they are. So that's four from the first lot, five, six. Will you remember six, please? Six, yeah. Because I will definitely forget. Well, it's two dead Ogrins the way I'm rolling. <laughs> <laughs> it is. It is. So that's another five, another five. So Sorry, 11. 11. So 11 to wounds. Oh, yeah, sorry. Because you're getting ahead of yourself. Rich was about to roll the same. <laughs> well, I've just seen you roll, so I'm presuming. <laughs> so threes. Oh, oh <laughs> far off. Eight. So four, six, eight. So fours. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so feel no pain. So that is one dead and one has two wings left. Okay. Um, Nine companions are going to fire their melter guns <laughs> because they've got nothing else to do this. Turn. So six of them hit. Two to wound. He Ooh. dies. I think it's his feeling of pain. Oh yeah, because he's only strength eight. Yeah. So Two, three wounds. He dies. <laughs> Just if he dies, he dies. Um. We're dying, you cowards! Um, 
I'm going to launch frag shells from my quad mortars into your squad on the objective. <laughs> okay. Um, so I definitely can't see. If you go, like he's probably your best bet, and you'll get all but two. So you'll get. Okay. So I'll do that one. Six. Is that on yeah. the Vectila's head? So it goes uh, off the five. guy next to him. Five. I, th I imagine it will be well off. Uh, it's only just missing him. So you. Uh, you so. Oh, that's bad scatter. Uh, not really. Yeah. That's going to get you two. Let's get in the back of those two guys. Oh, brilliant! So twos. So two. Um, so it's just four. Up. So one. One's dead. Um, just take a guy from the back. I've got multi lasers from these two. Yeah. Of which I'm going to go into your quads. Yeah. The front one, I guess. Oh. Uh, Yeah, into your quads. And the pintle from here will go into the... I don't need to do... I, why am I declaring it before I've done the other <laughs> things? I don't know. I don't know. So, yeah, into the front quads. I get three hits. And it's on majority toughness, so three wounds now. Okay, yep. Yeah, so three four-ups. Yeah. One dead. Okay. That was it. Yeah, these guys were... Yes. Um... Multi laser from here into your squad on the objective. Yeah. So I know you love running away when you're taking off casualties. <laughs> so two wounds. Oh, one, one dead. Is that enough for a test? Uh, no. no. It's two out of uh, three. Six. Yes, it's two out of eight. So it's twenty five percent. Oh really? Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Annoyingly. That is the end of my shooting. So over to your so just panic a check. Test yeah. for those guys. Ooh, it's, do you know Fine. what? It, oh. oh no, they've not got a box. They're leadership nine. They, it was out of the box, so I was going oh. to tell you oh. again. <laughs> there you go. It's up to you. I'll tell no, you. no, it's, it's out of the box. So leadership so, nine. Yeah. Um, because then they're not. They haven't got a box that squad. So he's fine. Fine. Yeah. I'll, I'll take it's out of the box. It all, <laughs> whether it's good or bad, it's out of the box. <laughs> so that is yeah. That's the end of the shooting. Charging. I'm going to charge my Cyclops into a non-stupid target this time, and it's going to be your Dracosin. This one or this one? Yeah. Or the lesser wounds one. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So well, I think you're in. in. Yeah. Right. Strength ten, armor bane against the rear. Yeah, I can't do anything against this. So it's a, so it's a pen. Oh, is it oh no, it's, it's armor eleven at the back. So you could double one it. No, so no. you pen. <laughs> and then see what he does. AP one. Ah, immobilized. That's okay, and a whole point. Yes. That's, uh, yeah, that has annoyed me. So he's on three left, is it? Yes. Yeah. Excellent. Right, so that is the end of Thoracite's turn three. And you scored two points there, didn't you? I did, so I'm on three to your two. Yes. This is my turn three. Yes, it is. It is your turn three. I'm going to get my Volkites out and go here, because there's not really anywhere I can go. What I want to know is, can my other... The one, the, my Dracosin that can move. Yeah. Can it ram your squad on the objective? Um, this one? Yes. Because they're, they're both actually on the objective. Ah, They're right, both okay. within three. In which case it doesn't really matter. So what we'll do, we'll just get all these out. So they should all, in fact, let's make sure they can all, they should all be able to see somebody from the back squad. Right, okay. Because there's not a lot else I can do. Let me just make sure they're all within 15. They will be. 15. Uh, I need to just get myself ready for your templates again and just put them all up like that. <laughs> well, so I can frag, I can shell them, is that? The problem I've got, they should have been there and they should have been further up. Um, mm. oh, there's not a lot I can do here. No, well, I think one thing you were saying it before, like you've Deployed too much to one side. Yeah, I've got a bit heavy on, on one fight, and also because they're scoring, I should have put them up there. Yeah, to just hold that. And then had those units up there. I've, I've been too slow coming forward over here, but I think at the minute it's just a case of kind of I can potentially stop you scoring two objectives. So yeah, I've got to get these guys because it's just those. Is that part of your command squad? No, no, no. So these two clouds. Right. Are a separate squad. So. And then we've got to try and get at least one of them to run away. I don't think we'll kill both. Right, so we'll start over here. Yes. So the first lot of mortars is going to absolutely bomb. 
So if I go over him on that squad, yeah, I'll get pretty much all of them and a load of others. If but let's yeah. see. Let's hope the scattered ice are a bit kinder. <laughs> the favourable. So the first one hits, hits. Ooh, which nice. is great, and then the second one hits. So you it anywhere, which is good. So ah yeah. So the first one's ten. Ten from the front squad, squad and. and from the front I think five. five. So ten and five, and then the second one you can place anywhere that you want again. So I think we'll do that there, which I think is getting me eight of that squad. Yeah. And oh, I should have I should have reacted. Um, all but two of the command squad. Yes. So how many are in the command squad? Eleven. Because there's a have a touch character. Yeah, so I've got 18 on your, on your front unit, well, yeah. 14. Right. So I'll do the 18 first, so six, yeah. eight, I'll just do, <laughs> I'll do nine. So these are twos with shred. Goodbye, squad. So nine off the first half. Yeah. And yeah, so you've got nine, 18. Got so I'll roll, I will also roll nine twice. So that's five from the first lot. <laughs> and this is going to be five, isn't it? Oh, four. So one's left alive. <laughs> and obviously, it will be the Vox who is closest and just within yeah. three inches of and then the objective. Four, nine. It was 15 on your command squad. <laughs> so, again, twos. Um, with. With shred? Yeah. So, so 14. 14. How do you want to do it? So these aren't doubling me out, so I'm not going to be a complete bell end. Do they have two wounds? They do. Ah, right. Yeah, right, yeah. yeah, that's why. So that was why I had to tank on the character, because otherwise you'd have just wiped the entire squad by yeah. doubling them out. So I'm not going to be a bell end, and I'm going to start just taking on the squad. So <laughs> okay. 14. 14, yeah. So the first 10. Oh. So that's four. Five, six. So three dead. And four more. <gasps> seven, eight, nine. Four so and a half. Four and a half. So, there we go. And this is how sad. Oh. So that is the two grenade launchers gone. Do you want to annoy him? Go on. I need to kill him. Yes. So I was going to frag him. Uh, so I was going to shatter shell him, but I can't see him. Well, you can attempt the long bomb. I think I have to because I haven't got anything else. I'm going to evade. <laughs> <laughs> Which I should have done with, obviously, with the last one. But he, yeah, he's going to evade. Um, there's literally nothing else. Yeah, because everyone else out of range. Right, so we'll try it. Yeah. It's over him. So if it does hit. No, seven inches off. It's gonna go all that way, so it's gonna go there. Yeah. Um, and then let's see the one. flipping. Ah. So you just get all of them, including him. Oh, it won't get all. I think you can position anywhere, can't you? Anywhere, you've got to still be touching that, haven't you? So yeah. I'll get it'll get all but one and him. So that's six. So how many was the first? Oh, sorry, I forgot. Did you yeah, yeah. yeah. Did you count the first? No, I think it's two. Right, so so eight, two. eight and one. Okay. Yeah, because right. the, the second one was all but but one. Okay. So we'll do the, the one's the important one. Oh. So it's wounded. Do you want to do? So four up. Evade. Oh, hey. he's dead. Four, and then we've got the eight on your command squad yes. with shred. Yeah, so you've got eight. So eight. And one of those is wounded, isn't he? Yes. So not nine off the first. Six, seven, eight. So three. Yeah, so, so one. The one that's wounded and, and then another one. Another one. Oh. So just all the regular blokes. And they are not, they're actually outside of the range of the objective. At yes. The yeah, which is a big one. When you're ready. My um, Volkites are going to shoot into that squad. So the rear squad that's on the objective yes, over here? Yeah, because the one they can see. Wait. So I'll do two lots of ten. Yes. And threes. Ooh. Um, so this is to wound. 
So you've got Ooh, eight Hamza. wounds off the first half. Ooh. And then... Do you know what? Why do I keep forgetting to react to these Volkite squads? <laughs> um, four. So you've got 12 Volkite wounds. wounds. Yeah. So the first 10. Oh. And I'll re-roll two. So that's three, four, five, six, seven. So seven D flags. Three, six, seven, twos. Yep, seven more. So, yeah, he's dead. Oh, they're all dead. So that's the rear squad gone. So just the front one next to the objective now. Now, the issue I have is that annoying the aura is in, in the yeah, lane. Yeah, he can see literally the end one. Okay. He's going to be able to see yeah, quite a few. So we'll do the, if I can borrow your template, we'll do this guy into, yeah, the, whatever his best shot is. Yeah. Please. So yeah. you'll be able to get six no matter where you go. No, nope. so seven there. This one. Oh, so he's going to go five. Which, which is, I think will be off. Will you no, just measure that? Yeah, I don't think hands. it's going to be, yeah, it's going to be nowhere. Boom. And then the second one, which will be over his head. So we'll get, we'll still get five if you hit. Yep. Uh, that's it. And um, goes two. Two inches off, and it's a one and a half template. Yeah, so I think so it's going to be just off. You'll isn't get it? one, I say. Okay. It's a wound. He'll get a cover save. He will. Oh, uh, he's dead. It's 24 for the grenade launcher, isn't it, I think? Yeah. Yeah, so he's out of range. So I think three, five, I've got four, four rifles here into your companions. Yes. So threes, because they're good, oh, yeah, that's Ooh. a good one. And fours. Oh no. So three, three wounds. wounds on the companions. We've got four up saves, two, two one. so one takes a wound. And then... That last rifle section on the, the hill. There's only, there's only three that can see. So I'll do six more shots yes. into them because they can't see anything else. Okay. Uh, but these hit on fours because they're not so good. One wound. One wound. So the one on one wound lives. And sadly, I think that's it. Because <laughs> I don't have a lot left on the board. Yeah, so that's the end of your turn. that was my turn, turn. so we're 3-3 three, yeah. three at the minute, aren't we? Because I got the one. <laughs> So at the start of Thorakite turn four, we forgot the test for these, so we'll do that now. Great time to run away. Leadership 10, they love it. Fine, they love it. Don't be getting too hasty. So I score one, two objectives. So it goes to five, three. Five, three. Jeez. Um, I, don't know, I don't know what I actually need to do here. I, well, I, need, I know what I absolutely need to do right here is move on to that objective. I know what I need to do here is just get the companions out of the way and not do anything else with them. Because they've been, they, they killed some Ogrins, but, and they're not complaining about this game. <laughs> I'd just like to say that while I'm moving these companions, I'm not complaining about this game. The stars of the show has been everything else, not the companions with melter guns. Volkite Velataris are gonna run. And they're gonna get the oh they're gonna go eight because they're heavy. Oh heavy can't run at all, can they? Oh rubbish. R completely rubbish. They're just gonna get round. Oh, they're just gonna get in the transport actually for now then. Yep. And the transport's gonna attempt to not immobilize itself as it moves to there. Great time for a one always is. Oh no, he loves it. Um <laughs> these Laz rifles. Move to there, and these Laz rifles move six onto the objective. These Laz rifles just pivot. The Aurochs moves backwards. <laughs> Quads turn to face. Vanquishers <laughs> turn to face, turn to face, and move six to here, or oh, within its six. Now over to Richie's side of the table. Move my uh, things out of the way. I'm gonna move Pop the companions. 
to here. He's I... getting down to the boiling point, really. Come on. You can't react because you're artillery. Oh. I know, I know. So right? I know, I know, yeah, yeah. No, I do know that rule. It's really annoying, though. Mm. It's really annoying. So, um, shooting phase. Yeah. yeah. Shooting phase. Gonna start out by. Last rifles into the Volkite Velataris. I'm gonna shoot back. Oh no. Right, yeah, <laughs> you said it. You said it, I'll stick with it. So. <laughs> We're doing this the non-stupid way, right? Yeah, you've already scored the objective anyway, haven't you, this turn? So, uh, so it wasn't that. I actually wanted to fire at them with the quads because they're AP4. Ah, uh, right, So I could have okay. ripped through them and then I could have <laughs> fired them at something further back. But yeah, you do. You, we're doing this simultaneous, I imagine. Yeah. Because we're not. Well, we went to the Warhammer we, World event um, last week and the staff there, that's the way they ruled it. It's, right. It's all at the same time. So you go first. Well, you go first because it's your. No, you go first. Okay. Simultaneous. So I've got um, six, eight, <laughs> ten. So two lots of ten. So <laughs> hitting on threes. And I'll do, I'll wound and do it again. Uh, so six off the first half. Oops. Yeah. And um, seven hits and uh, five. So 11, you've got 11 wounds. Right. So 11 armor saves. Oh, that wasn't bad. I've got four dead. Um, so four D flags when I get my dice out of the box. So three. I've just thought, I think I was wounded on three twos. Three armor there. saves. I think I was wounded on threes, not twos. <laughs> I think I think I've done. It doesn't matter. I think I've done myself a few. Ugh. I can't remember. Tell us in the comments. Do you want to just do it again? No, no. Just just do it. It's decent. <laughs> so seven plus two. Oh, I killed one, didn't I? Yeah, yeah. So I was just thinking I'd not quite wiped the squad, but I have. So yeah. so it didn't didn't matter. Yeah. No. I, I was picking up the the twos for the hits, and then I started picking up the twos for the wounds. I think as well. Yeah. Well, he's he's been used to playing marines wounded on threes all the time. Yeah. Very easy. But well, that was a demonstration of why that was stupid. <laughs> <laughs> but you still get your shots. I do. I do. But I should have actually just not done anything with them this turn so that you couldn't have returned fire. Yeah. But I didn't think about it. Didn't think about it. And I can't really complain. <laughs> That's a lot of hits. <laughs> so eight hits and eight Three. wounds. Oh, strength sixes. Oh, your Volk. Like, yeah, 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 that's why I was... Yeah, sorry, I was thinking you're right. Uh, so... Sorry, I don't think I actually even said that. I just rolled the... The wounds, sorry. Yeah. That's all right. Eight. Uh, five, that's all right. Five? Yeah. So five dead? Yeah. And then you get... No, no, that's it. Ah, yeah, that, that's it, your single shot. I, yeah, yeah. I forgot to say it there, I was firing the single shots. I'm just going to do all the Auroxes at once, or two Auroxes at once. Yeah. Both going to fire into the Volkite Velataris. So hitting on fours, wounding on twos, two wounds. Two four ups. Oi. Uh, I'm gonna fire. I'm gonna fire this vanquisher at your wounded demolished cannon, Russ. Okay. Oh, your wounded Dracosin. So the auto misses twice. The vanquisher hits once. Uh, Thirteen. Thirteen from. Sunder. Sunder. Nothing. No. And the lads on the hull. Nothing. <laughs> the Russ on the hill. Yeah. He's gonna fire at the this one right in front of it. Yeah. Two hits. Two hits with the coaxial auto cannon. The Vanquisher cannon <laughs> hits twice. <laughs> with Sunder. Does nothing. And the whole Laz cannon misses. Finally, the last Russ is gonna do exactly <laughs> the same. So the coaxial auto cannon misses twice. The Vanquisher hits Hit. twice yeah. to pen. Gets one with Sunder. Pen and a glance. Pen and a glance. I don't know if there's any cover. Get a six up cover. So the pen. No, the glance. Oops. Oop. Not in that. No. So, so both go through. What does the pen do? <laughs> Snap shooting. But at least it can't fire its ordnance. So it took two there, didn't it? Because it Yes. Was, it took the... Yeah. So my quads. What I want to do is fire into the vehicle. But I think what I need to do is fire into your Velataris. That would be the sensible one. With a blast, so, by a chance? No, with Ooh, my oh, yes. yeah, yeah. 
shots because you're heavy as well. So you would be re-rolling your armor saves. Yep. So I hit on fours. Three, four? Four. I'm killing on twos. Yeah, killing on twos. Oh, two <laughs> ones. <laughs> Take those two in a minute. Yeah, sorry, that guy's the sergeant. So. Yeah, and um, will you just check whether my companions are in range of your artillery? Some actually? of them definitely are. Um, so you've got... Which one do you want to shoot at? Um, the closest one. Yeah, so I think you've got... I think you've got three that are within range and can see this. Because okay. he's out of range. That's cool. Um Yeah, I'm going to do... I'm not going to fire. I can't react to him, but... I know. Um, so that's the end of my shooting phase. I'm going to charge with them companions. Because if I'm in charge, if I'm in melter gun range, I'm in charge range. What's the charge range? Um, about nine and a half. So I think so it's ten. ten. Uh, I can't overwatch. No. Ah, uh, no, but I go three inches forward. Do you want me to move them? Yes, please. <laughs> oh, I forgot they were on there. There we go. And that is... The end of Thorakite turn three, so I scored two points that turn. So five, three, yeah. and then I'll score one again at the start of this turn. Yeah, so five, into, four. Into Evil Auxilia, turn four. So, so Rich, what are you doing? Oh, leadership test for the Vel oh, yes. So they've got a box still. There we, oh, there we go. Yeah. So, this guy's snap firing, isn't he? Mm. So what he's going to do is just bomb up 12. Yes. And pivot a little bit. And then these guys are going to get, I think there's only one, but one will do. Yeah. And just to they, maybe eke out that objective. And they've just got to live. <laughs> I want to live. Um, he's immobilised, I think, isn't he? Yes. Uh, no, I think he... I think he did. He got, he got mobilised by the Cyclops. He got he had to oh, stop he, he, yeah, 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 I think so. Surprisingly, that's about it. Okay, so who are you shelling this turn? So these guys are lying because of the banner, aren't they? You're gonna shell them, are you? Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to. Okay. So with the this is with the back lot to start with. Okay, I'm gonna evade. Okay. Put so oh there. yeah. Can you see? Do you want the... No, because your tank's still in the way because you didn't move it. So it's going to go... Tactical genius, Rich. Tactical genius. Over, over to there, so it's only if it's a good flip. No. Bad flip. And then we'll do the second unit, which also comes. And I've already evaded, so yeah. can't do it again. Wait. Oh, he gets all fives. So, and then the second shot. Yeah. Gets all fives, so ten. Ooh. Four, seven... Ten. Okay. On twos, re-rolling the ones. With shred. To all ten. Come on, the boys. Oh, I'm gonna have to start tanking. <laughs> I'm too low in that squad. Oh, I don't want to tank. I'm gonna do three at a time. On your. I'm gonna do six at a time because that's how many wounds are before my banner. Okay. Yep. Yeah. So three. Oh. Just on three normal guys. Yeah, three normal guys until they're gone. I don't care about oh. them. So that's two dead. So. <laughs> three dead. He's dead, and then two on my, on my warlord, who takes a wound. So he's on three wounds he has remaining. four wounds, doesn't he? Yeah. He does. So, that is just the banner and my warlord remaining. And it will be another test for them at least, but I don't think there's anything else to shoot at them. So yeah. what we're going to check... Yeah, so all of the command squad, including the grenade launcher, are in range of your companions. companions. Cool. So I'll do the grenade launcher first, because he's yes. a bit different. So he hits, and he it wounds. wounds. It's AP4, so just one gets doubled out. But yes, because it's one on one wound. Yeah, and then... I don't know if all so the characters... rifles from the command squad? Yeah, do the characters have rifles, do you know? Yes, unless, oh, you swap them, yeah, unless you swap them out. I've just upgraded them, haven't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Apart from the Warlord, who doesn't. So four, eight. So it'll be 14 shots. Yes. So hitting on threes, because these are the good ones. 
say that. And then we're going to jump on fours. fours. Oh, that's decent. Uh, six wounds. So six wounds on fours. Oh, five hey. dead. Oh, five, five, five wounds. wounds. Yeah. So, yeah, what you, you should have actually done the six up or the strength six, Rich, because Last, then yeah. you would have doubled them out. And then I've got three normal LAS rifles that can see them. That are going to double. <laughs> They're going to go for the doubles or. Uh, no, because I'm more than 18 away. Right. Um, ah, right, okay. But, yeah, I'm more than So that's why you didn't there. Yes, yeah. So, uh, fours. That's pretty good. And then fours. fours. That's not. So, one more. Can it kill the wounded one? No. no. But I think it will be a test for them, won't it? Cause it I'm... will, because you kill three. Ah, I've got one more. I've got my Jacosin. You have. Who is going to shoot at this thing and try and. Okay. <laughs> we'll put it right at the back. <laughs> right at the back. Further away. No, overhanging next to your tank. So. <laughs> it's still going to hit you, I think. It goes that way. Oh, yeah, I think it might hit us both, is the worrying thing. Three. Do you want to move that? It's going to go to there. So I think. Get it's both? Uh, yeah. So it gets you in the rear. Beautiful. And he gets me in the front. I can't, I can't blow myself up. So, so you pen me on anything? But, oh no, you don't always fail on a one, do you? So uh, for this, yeah, so, so you it's pen. All, it's ordnance, so it's a pen. Yeah. Um, but yeah, there's no AP, so it can't blow you up. So you snap firing and can't move. Yes, which is decent. But then you get to. Yeah. Uh, I'm so, 11 at the back, so if you roll a double one. I oh, it's strength 12. 12. <laughs> so oh, it, it, yeah. it pens. Yeah. And then see what happens. So mobilised. <laughs> I don't mind that. <laughs> Friendly fire. So, Cheers. do you want to do a test for your warlord? I do, I do. So, leadership 10. Oh, loves it. And then for these guys, have they got a box? Oh uh, yeah, yeah, every okay. squad has yeah. a box. Literally, it's five point upgrade, every squad has a box. Okay, so five, four at the minute. Yeah. So into my turn. Uh, so yeah. So and I score two. So seven four. Yeah. My companions here are going to move six inches and uh, get to here. And I can't react. Nope. My other companions are going to move six inches and get to here. My Philotaris stupidly got into this transport last turn, forgetting that it was a five turn game. <laughs> so well, It's five and roll, technically. Oh, is it? It's yeah, game it's then. five and roll, yeah. Oh, so I might want to get these Laz rifle. So they'll get out six to the barrels next to your Volkite squad. My Laz rifles here are going to move up their six to here. I'm gonna check whether I get immobilized. Oh! Ooh, so you're right, yeah. So I'm back, I'm actually back there. Yeah, does, that won't make a massive difference. But I get out four, so it does. Ah, so my Velatari yeah. squad. So my Velatari squad actually gets out to there, but my Aurox is just gonna pull back a little. It can't move. That one can. It can't hit the. Demolition. Oh, it can't move at all, can it's it? it? Yeah, it's this, it's this turn, it's not immobilised, but it can't move. Obviously. Yeah, because you actually... stunned it, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's big. It's actually really big. It was right back up there as well. Um, no, it might mean I can't wipe out the Velotaris, which oh. gives, might give you attrition. So, we've worked out up to now, it's actually in the down to the teeth of it because Rich might win on attrition, which gives D3 victory points in it. Yeah, it's 7-4 at the moment, though. Mm. But you'll get at least one, I think, in your turn. So, my my quads are just going to stay where they are. The Vanquisher is going to go there. Do you want to react? Um, I think I'm, I'm more than 12 away, aren't I? No. Oh, sorry, he's immobilised. Oh, he is, isn't he? Yeah. <laughs> Every, literally everything is getting immobilised this game. Everything is useless. Every, everything of mine. Oh, and yours, I suppose. The Russ yeah. is going to move to there. 
that rust is gonna stay where it is. That's, that's it for movement, yeah. So I'm gonna start out with the quads that are gonna land two shells on your So squad. if you go over okay. here, you'll get all but one. So if I hit, I get five, I do. Five and then second one. Flips and gets one and on the side of the... Yeah, because you're literally gonna be yeah. over him. So you can't hurt that, but you've got no. six hits. So six to wounds, I get six to wounds. I should have. Oh. Ah, this got me last turn. So, four ups. Wait! Oh, two? Yeah, I'll take that. And amazingly. Losers. Two from the back. So, Ooh, hang on. No. It's going to be him and him. Okay, so. My companions here. Yeah. Are going to fire into. Are going to fire into <laughs> this quad malt battery. Yeah. So that's three, four, five, six, seven. I can't shots. react because I'm artillery. No. As we learned earlier. Yes. So I hit five, five times and I wound three times on your majority toughness. So you can take a crewman off of and. So one and then two wins on the gun? Yeah. So I allocate them and the crewman and the crew stays. Yeah. So my snap firing Aurox here. Into those, Into yeah. Into Velataris. No hits. Um, my Russ that's here. Yeah. Is in the front still, I think, of your... I would say so, yeah, just... Your Dracosin. So it's... Are you reacting? No. So the Coaxel <laughs> hits once. No. Nothing. The Vanquisher re-rolls. Nothing. Ooh. The last cannon oh, no. hits with Glances. Sunder. So the Sunder allows me to re-roll, which I have to get a pen. Oh, snap fire next turn. But the big thing is it's down to one. It is, it is. Um, what's it on the side? 12? 13, 12, 11, yeah. So I'm gonna fire this Aurox <laughs> into the side. Hits once. I need a six. No. <laughs> I'm gonna fire the Aurochs from the other side of the battlefield into the side. You I get, think I'll get a six cover. up cover for yeah. you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One hit. One hit. Oh, I can get the sixes <laughs> on the to hit, but not to wound. Um, I'm going to fire, I'm gonna fire the Russ that's hiding behind the building. Into okay. the side. I'm going to shroud because I think okay. I'll get a six up cover for. So the coaxel hits. Hits. No. Nothing. The vank. So one's out. So that. Right. So that hits. Yeah. And then the, the re roll for the. Yep. Thing hits. So you need threes. So one pen. Sunder. A glance and a pen. So my six up against the pen. Yep. No. Six against the glance. No. So the five, five up against the pen, no, and the five up against the glance. So Does it explode? No. No. So, do you have to put a smoke marker on it, or should I throw it about? <laughs> At this point in the game, throw it about. <laughs> uh, I'll try and find them. So, the Russ on the hill yep. is going to fire into the rear Dracosin here. Okay. Mm, yeah, I'm not shouting that. Yeah, that's what he's going to do. So the Coaxel misses twice. The Vanquisher, with the re-roll, hits once. It does nothing. And the last cannon. Nothing. <laughs> nothing. These have been pretty useless this game. Imagine if we had night fighting, no one would have shot each other for I know. turns. Um, Multi-lasers are going to attempt to fire into your forwards artillery battery, but I don't, I'm gonna, like, he's a vain hope, Rich. It's spiteful. <laughs> <laughs> no, definitely can't see. I think I'm about getting there, to be honest. There's not much that I can do. Do you think that's where that Aurochs was? As in, oh, you have to literally... declare that Volkites into them, because I know I moved it and... Yeah, I think, how many can you see? Because I don't think you oh, can only see... Only like one or two at Yeah, most. that's what I thought. Like, definitely not more than two. I see, like, you definitely see that back one, because he's right out. I don't know if you can see the uh, other guy. I don't, I don't think I can... Oh, I can get his head. So I can get one of that Volkite squad. 
Which, oh, will be enough to force the panic. It will, yeah. So, 10 Volkite shots into the, the one rear guy. Four misses. Winded on twos. <laughs> it is winded on twos, yeah. So, four. four. Can we do it? <laughs> oh. Oh. Go on, the boy. So, yeah, they, they survive. Um, I'm going to declare a charge. Oh, first, your leadership test. Yeah, so because there were the six inches yes. of them. Yeah, they're it. good. They're and good. I'm going to declare a charge from... So you've got to go to them, haven't you, because you shot them? Uh, the front, the, the closest squad does. Yeah. But the rear squad is going to charge the further away. Ooh. So... Yeah, you're gonna be on. Oh, a... No, I'll, I'll go into the nearer one. I'll, they'll both go into that nearer one. Okay, so you're on a ten still there. Well, do you want to do? Yeah, so the to closer first? one. So they're on a four. They get in, and the further one get in on a ten. <laughs> so uh, let's just work this out because literally he'll be in. And then I'll pile in three. Oh yeah. So they'll all be. I'm just working out if there's going to be anyone left behind. What of killing them two dudes? <laughs> uh, yeah, I think I think you're going to be in by the time you get in. Cool. And we'll look up whether they've got close combat weapons. So I've got 16 models engaged, each of which are getting three attacks because of the charge. I've got two. We're all the same initiative, yep. so you do your two first. One, One hit. hit. Oh no, I'm weapon skill higher than yours because I'm a companion. Oh, I'm weapon skill three, aren't I? Yeah, yeah. so you don't hit. No hits. So 16 dudes attacking three times is... 48. Thank you. Yeah. So, the first 10, Do you I want hit to... eight times. I'm rolling to wound I was now. gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> so I wound four times against the two dudes. They're dead. Thank God for that. And they're both gonna consolidate. So everyone's just hugging there. Oh, we've got a problem now. Yeah, and that's over to Evil Octilia, turn five. So going into turn five, very sadly, I've lost the audio for this game at this point. So Rich moves his Velataris squad that survived my last turn onto the objective in preparation for turn six. He then moves his Laz rifle section onto the objective and then realises that he actually has to run or not run but move the full six minus two for going through woods to get onto that objective so can't fire with them this turn he then moves his rapier carriages in front of my companions to block them from from my to block my companions from shooting their melter guns into his command squad in turn six i then react to his movement of the rapiers to just basically get within an inch of the rapiers i'm looking for kill points here in turn six. Mm. Potentially I could multi-charge both of them because it's quite an easy unit to wipe out. He then moves his command squad further away from my companions to just make that charge a bit harder. So he's really just trying to deny warlord kill which could equalize if we end up very close on points which currently with these two points in it I believe after Rich's turn five. So he then fires his demolish cannon into my Aurox because he can't actually see anything else, which is everything else is blocked by his Decrosen. So he gets the hit and then his ordinance actually only causes a penetrating hit, which I don't save um, and I don't evade. And his penetrating hit basically just means I snap shoot in the next turn. And I can't balance dice apparently. So after that, it, Rich's meaningful stuff that he can do is his quad mortars into my Aurox. Now on this, we knew that actually we were tied on kill points at this point for attrition at least. So he rolls his eight shots and gets three hits, which is enough to do it because this vehicle is only on two hull points left and he gets two penetrating hits on fives which then I don't manage to save either of them. So he then wrecks the vehicle. And basically that is the end of Rich's turn five because he's got no assaults and everything else has run. 
So Rich rolls at the end of his turn for the random game length and on a four plus we carry on the game and we don't. So at this point we go away to calculate victory points and we will get the roll for attrition done in the wrap up. So welcome back to the wrap up and thank you for staying here if you were still here on this serial killer style monologue. It's actually a real shame that we lost this with Rich because Rich and me went through a few points about the game which we really enjoyed uh, which I'll go over with you like from what I remember because this was only last night now. So before that we have to know who won on attrition that was Rich so he rolls a d3 and gets this result and that's a two so he gets one victory point for his attrition score. So that actually ties us on overall game points across the entire game. I really thought I smashed Rich throughout all of this, but I said a few times to him over the game that he's got a real way of bringing himself back in the game. And he keeps, he manages to eke out these draws when he's been behind for quite a few times. He manages to capitalise on things that people have done wrong. And that's things like when I shot my Laz rifle squad on the objective on our camera left at his Velataris and I immediately knew I'd done it wrong. And he, and, but he was ready to return fire and just immediately blow them away. Now, with that, I think both of our armies, he was playing with a 500 point handicap in them Dracosans. Like there's just nothing nothing that can be done about that one except him not taking them i think next time he wants to take more infantry tertios because he'd felt that my infantry dominance had really won out across the game and given me more options now i actually really enjoyed this game with him i think it showcased the auxilia really well something that i would like to do with my army is maybe get more quad mortars i do think i'm lacking anti-tank like the vanquishers just weren't good enough across the game but I think that that could be counteract. Like the companions are good, but they're very short ranged. I could, I've got two Thunderbolts sat unpainted that I could maybe paint, but I need to wait for the studio so that I can film doing them for everyone to watch. So, you know, in case they actually come out all right, possibly. And if not, it'll be consigned to the do not edit pile. But no, I thought it was a really close game and really enjoyed it. I, so I was using mini mag trays across this game and it's something that's really helped me still have fun playing auxilia and militia type armies where you've got lots of models. It really made the process a lot sleeker of moving about the table. So you can get them from the link below and there is a, a discount code that's offered to Patreon members, which you can find on the Patreon below. If you did like the game, don't forget to hit like, comment, subscribe, all that sort of stuff. It would let me know that you guys like this sort of content in the future so that I will film more of it and get more on the channel. If you really liked it, as I mentioned before, there's the Patreon link below where you can get discount codes to mini mag trays, to Laser Forge Miniatures, which is a 3D printing company in the UK, as well as access to the Discord and the bouncy trays that you can see used on most of the games on the channel. And with that, I won't bore you for any longer. And thank you for watching. Thank <music> you.